Yo, yo, what's up guys, Chris Tips one how's everyone doing? Welcome to Live Vibe 121. It's freaking Friday, dude. We're here to vibe tonight, man. I hope everyone is having a great night today. I'm gonna show you guys, I filmed a video earlier, we're gonna talk about what's in my freezer. All the different cans that I've had that I've reviewed for the past several months here on the Live Vibe. After that, we got our question of the day, followed by deal or no deal, followed by Live Vibe After Dark, which tonight we're featuring you guys for Live Vibers Spotlight. Hope everyone is doing well today, man. Today, I am dipping, since I did the tour, right? Some Golden Light by Outlaw. Outlaw Dip is a proud sponsor of the Live Vibe. You can use code LIVE, you can, not LIVE, you can use code VIBE10 to save you 10% off at outlawdip.com. Dudes, today our mods is gonna be, Dark Hills is, is, is taking the reins today. And myself, I'm I, I'm gonna help with the mods. I, I do know we got like Jaden and Ninja. If you guys wanna help out tonight, please do so. Keep your thoughts and prayers. Send positive vibes to our boy Logan. Um, he's dealing with something uh, right now, and um, it's not in my place to air out what happened. But just keep him in your thoughts, guys. He's he's fine. He's healthy. He's alive. But. Just keep them in your thoughts. If you're a praying man, pray for Logan. We love you, Logan. We love you, brother. So here we go. Let's start off with this video, man. Let's start off with this video. This is... <laughs> All right, I'm just, I'm just going to play it. It's me and Joe Rogan. <laughs> All right, so the, store, the freezer is the best way to uh, store your dip. And I'm just gonna give you a quick tour of what uh, I have. Obviously doing the live vibe, I get to review a lot of dips. Most of these are actually gonna be outlaw dips. But let's just go down the line. Zen Citrus. Ooh, this is still available, $2.99, outlawdip.com, baby. Irish Cream Dream. This, uh, Skullberry, this is a full can. This is a full can. I got some, ooh, Ramblin' Root Beer. Ooh, fresh can, Lucky Lipper. Zone, these are good. Zone mints, nine milligrams. I got some can of dips, CBD. The peach stuff, dude. This was a weird one. This one had an acidic taste. I mean, it sucked at first, but it, it, it was good towards the end. The flavors came out, but still weird. This is 12 milligrams. What do I got here? Peach, Skull Peach, Timberwolf Peach. Longhorn peach. Most of the live vibers think this is the best. This is the best one, right? Okay. I like Timberwolf better. We got some wintergreen stokers. Sesh. This is good shit. Eight milligrams. This is a new company a lot of people don't know about. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. The Copenhagen packs. Not Copenhagen packs. Copenhagen black. This is still probably full. This is a full can of freaking Copenhagen wintergreen. This is, you know, when shit hits the fan, guys. When the grid goes out, World War, you know, freaking whatever happens, I'm going to be set. I don't need to go on a dip run. I got plenty of freaking dip. Husky wintergreen. Not bad, guys. Husky ain't bad. Timberwolf wintergreen. Yes. I got some more Irish cream. I think this is the fat cut. The other one was, I think, pouches. But I got a few of those. I got Velo. Velo, I am not impressed at all. These, yeah, not the best. I ain't gonna lie, dude. Not the best. More Velo, black cherry. On, wintergreen, what is this, cinnamon, mint. Those are okay. Red seal, don't sleep on red seal, guys. What is this? Oh, this is the Copenhagen packs. This is the stuff, this is that tar stuff, dude. This is the craziest looking can. It's like snooze, man. This gives you the craziest buzz. Jesse got me this when you went to uh, Virginia or West Virginia, the Silverback. Outlaw recently did a video on that too. This is good shit, man. Levi Garrett, I'm still waiting for some freaking wintergreen. I haven't tried the wintergreen. That's that row. Then I got some Zone, Zone Citrus, which isn't bad. And I got some Siberia. This shit's super strong. Blood Eagle, bro. Eagle's blood. Blood Eagle, Eagle's blood. I got another can. This is full of Siberia. Zen Cinnamon, Zen Coffee. This actually wasn't too bad. This was actually the most flavor in any Zen flavor line can. 
Zinc Spearmint, Red Velvet. Oh, you cannot sleep on red. Oh, you can now, it's not available. <laughs> this is still going on. You can still get the freaking lemon swirl, dude. This is beautiful. Out, oh, my favorite Outlaw dip. Georgia peach, Georgia freaking peach, dude. Watermelon, close second. More watermelon, Ironside. This is the caffeine dip. This is Sweden's fish. Zone dragon fruit. Dragon fruit was awesome, dude. Dragon fruit was good. Meat and honey, berserker. Berserker Sweden's fish. This is my favorite berserker, by the way. The winter berry. Winter berry berserker, dude, yes. This is something I've never tried that I just took from, look at how frosty that is. Candy cane. Candy cane, dude. I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna try it in December. It'll, it'll be a year old, but I'm thinking I'm gonna buy it with it. This, dude. One of my favorite ever, Golden Delight. Look how many of these suckers. This one's a fresh one, dude. Golden Delight. This one has a few pouches in there left. Golden Delight. Do not sleep on this one either, guys. This is a staple, dude. Backwoods Blueberry. More, more Lucky Lipper. Zone Wintergreen. So yeah, that's basically my little collection of dip. And uh, it's gonna grow, it's gonna grow. I'm gonna need more room. <laughs> oh, I wanna show you guys this out. These are the burgers I get. This is the cheapest I can get right now. It's 12 bucks, I get six patties. A third, you know, they're, they're fat, they're juicy, dude. Some, some freaking frozen fruit. Yeah. That's a freezer tour, bro. This is on my dip, bro, isn't that cute? All right, there it is. Holy shit. So what do you guys think, man? What do you guys think? Do you guys store your dip in the freezer? Do you store it in the fridge? Do you have a back? Do you have a stock in it, man, basically? Are you prepping for the freaking end times? I am, dude. I am set. Like, I think that'll last me a year, dude. I don't know. I mean, I, if, if I do it sparingly, I think it can last a quite a while. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys are vibing. It's freaking Friday. If you haven't already done so, do me a favor and like the video. I appreciate you all. I'm going to be going to comments here shortly after I talk to you guys about the question of the freaking day. The question of the day. Right. Oh, that was not right there. That was a video. This is the question of the day. What's your favorite way to spend your day off? Your favorite way. What's your most relaxing thing? Like, just pretend like, I don't know, if you're a family man, like, I don't know. Say the kids are out, right? Like, what's your ideal way? Like, this is save your save your by yourself. You like to fish? Do you like to order freaking pizza and get fat and freaking just freaking play video games? Do you like to go on a run? I mean, dude, I ain't actually. If it's my favorite thing to do on my day off, I ain't training. I ain't doing shit. I'm finding things that are relaxing, things that bring me joy. What brings you guys joy? Is it working on your car? Is it golfing? Let me know. That is this question of the day. I'm going to vibe up in comments, see how you guys are doing, dude. It's freaking Friday, dude. It's another freaking week of the live vibe, dude. It's crazy. What's up, Patrick? How you doing, man? I have no idea about mud jugs right now, Patrick. Good for you, brother, but you know I don't work for them anymore, right, Patrick? You know I'm like no more, you know, with them, but... You're dipping that mix of Coke Black and Southern Blend. How do you like that combo, Patrick? I hope you're vibing with it, brother. Hell yes. Jaden, how you doing, buddy? How's that? <laughs> Fisher the Great? Shit. There's some, there's some Fisher. Have you been on the live vibe before? What burns this right, buddy? What burns this right? Gregory, punch that like button. Absolutely, guys. Drop a like on this video, man. Trent, how you doing? Try to pack that spit and get ready for the live. The life vibe, huh? It's the life vibe. I like that. Okay, for sure. Jacobson's Wintergreen. How y'all doing? Dude, Jacobson's... I've tried Jacobson's Wintergreen, dude. It was good. It's a good snooze, man. I haven't heard of that. I mean, I heard of Jerk Gibson's like melon and all those other flavors, but... I remember. It's like... It's a white can. Dark green label. Hell yes, man. Mr. Mofo, how you doing, man? Welcome back, dude. Welcome back. That's back-to-back -back days for Mr. Mofo. Just another day, brother. How are you? Andrew, I am vibing, dude. It's been a long day. FYI, guys, I started editing the Dead Island 2 Part 1 gameplay today. I, it was an hour gameplay that I edited. I do. I cut right now the first cut of that hour gameplay is about 25 minutes. 
I want to cut that a little, maybe even shorter. But this is going to be a dying light style of editing. It's me, Jesse, and Spets. That's going to be up on my on on here on Sunday at 8 p.m. So if you guys want to get a feel back of the old zombie trio, part one of Dead Island is going to be on Sunday and late Sunday. It's probably going to be while it's up. We're going to be filming part two. And um, on Twitch, we're not going to be interacting if you guys want to watch live on, on Sunday. But um, yeah, you can watch it unedited that way. Once that live is over, it's not, no one else can, can see it. It's locked. So I can edit it and bring it up for the following week. But that's how it's, that's how it's going to be every Sunday from here on out at 8 p.m. It's going to be Dead Island 2. And it's going to probably take us, it's probably like a 12 parter. That's what Spets tells me. But dude, just editing, it's a different game than, it's a different game than Dying Light. It's a lot slower, but it's fun, dude. It's just a different vibe. It's a different feel. And uh, I can't wait to start this. Well, we restarted the series. So it's going to be dope, dude. It's going to be dope, man. But my day has been good, man. I hope yours is vibing, dude. I hope you're doing good, man. Shit, I'm off tomorrow. Is that a good thing or a bad thing, NC? Is that a good thing or a bad thing? What's up, Green? How you doing, man? I'm going to be joining you here shortly, if you know what I mean, Green. <laughs> Dark Hills, thank you. I, I see you, Dark Hills. Thank you, dude. Thank you. You're kicking ass, dude. Ninja Bear. Fire Nation. Damn it. Ninja, I forgot to get that damn sound effect. I need to get a sound effect for Fire Nation. It's been a wild day, man. It's it's been a wild day. <laughs> Jaden, dude, you rocking? You rocking, dude? What's up, I'm modified. How you doing, dude? You guys, let me know. What's your favorite way to spend your day off? Is it just laying in bed? Is it going for a, a nature walk? Is it hanging out with your significant other? Going to a botanical gardens? <laughs> it's time to get low, NC says. Low, 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 says Green. Do it up, man. No, 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 no. Hi, hi, hi. Renee, it's low. We call it low here. It's the opposite. Low is the op or it's the opposite of low. We don't like saying hi, hi, hi. <laughs> Happy Friday, everyone. Hope you had an amazing day. Let's make today's vibe the best one yet. Absolutely, Dark Hills. Absolutely, man. Tim, how you doing, Tim? Welcome back, brother. <laughs> What's up, Paul? You vibing, Paul? Paul's been joining us a lot now. Hell yes, Paul. Paul, I got your email, brother. I got your email. We'll be sharing your stuff tonight. A live vibe after dark. Fire Nation sends it to Logan. Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> if you haven't hit it yet, yeah, exactly. Hit that like button if you haven't yet, man. Woot woot. Candyman's back. What's up, Candyman? How you vibing, brother? How you doing? Nice to see you, dude. <laughs> Scooter Nick Paps is gross. If it ain't dip, it ain't shit, he says. <laughs> hey, man, to each his own, dude. I vibe with it at all, man. I vibe with it at all. Freezer CD. Freezer, dude. Is that... Is, you too? It's the best way to do it. I mean, I honestly think the, the, the fridge would be just as fine. My only issue with the freezer is like... Like, dude, when I did that tour, I'm like, dude, I am dipping some of that golden delight. I have plenty of cans there. But the thing with freezers is if, the, if your can is, is opened and say you just taken a pinch, it will, the lid will, the can, the plastic can will shrink because obviously cold and the lids will sometimes pop off, dude. So you gotta, the ones that are loose, like, like mm -hmm. I have some Copenhagen stuff in there that will burst open. You just gotta be careful with that shit, especially when you're pulling them out. I wasn't too careful when I was showing you guys though, but it was really hard to get my cell phone and not only that, that top shelf, bro, I was tiptoeing that shit. You probably, guys probably couldn't tell from that video, but I was tiptoeing. All hail the queen of the live by. What's up, Elena? How you doing, Elena? She's vibing with us. Hey, hope you're doing good. Hope work was good for you, Elena. <laughs> Everyone, Elena. We always scream her name. We always scream her name. <laughs> and see, I got four rolls of Grizzly Dark Wintergreen in my freezer, dude. 
Lucky. Grizzly Dark? Shit. How much? That'll, that'll cost... What? $200 for four rolls here in Florida, man. Jack the Ripper. What's up, Jack the Ripper? Ripper, welcome to the live by brother. I usually buy five cans of On. Wintergreen at a time. And keep them in my car. Do you like the On stuff, bro? My only issue with On, bro, is... is um. They're too damn tiny, dude. I like to feel like I got something in, in, in my lip, but that's something that they pride themselves for. But hey, Jack the Ripper, if you vibing with On, hell yeah, man. They slap too, dude. Like, don't, it'll kick your ass, dude. The first On I tried, bro, I put two of those suckers in and I was zinging, dude. I was zinging. Here we go, Jack the Ripper was the first one. First one. I like that. So, so what's your favorite way to spend your, your day off? Do you like to eat at a favorite restaurant? Do you like to visit uh, family? Jack the Ripper is just walking around in the woods in my backyard. Dude, if your backyard's the woods, dude, you're vibing and you're lucky. So I got you here, dude. Horrible writing, Chris. Come on. Come on, man. I know it's Friday. Walking in the woods. A walk in the woods, man. Being out in nature. I love that shit, Jack. On my days off, I love spending time with my family outside. Yes. Definitely outside, right? He's a family man, man. It's crazy, man. You got to spend as much time with your family as possible, especially especially if you're a family man. Because then those kids are going to grow up to be 13, 14, 15, 16. And then we all know how we were at that age. We don't want to hang out with our freaking parents. You got to love and cherish every moment with your kids. And see, working on my car, playing disc golf. You like to work on your car on your day off. You do it for funsies. I got you, dude. Which card, though, NC? You have like 20,000 of them. I can't keep track. Playing disc golf. I played disc golf once, dude. Do you get hammered like we do playing golf and shit? Can you guys bring coolers and shit? Well, in disc golf, you, I mean, they're all really, they're all like, what, part threes type of shit, right? But... There's no golf carts in disc golf. The golf carts are nice. You just put a cooler there or you get, you know, you slap them in your freaking, in your freaking uh, golf bag. But in disc golf, dude, they carry in disc golf. It looks like a cooler, dude. It looks like a cube cooler where you put all the freaking Frisbees, bro. Is that what you call them in disc golf? I don't know. But I've seen, I've seen the dudes, bro. I love to play golf. Why did I spell golf like that? <laughs> Speaking of disc golf, he hasn't been here vibing with us for a while. Where's disc golf at, man? Dipping and working on the... Dude, you got a Miata, dude? No freaking way, dude. That's so sick, dude. I like that, dude. Why you like working on the Miata, bro? Is it always broken down or what? What's going on? <laughs> Is that a normal thing? You got to work on your Miata? You guys, these are very humble things you guys are, are, are mentioning here. Simple, just fun stuff. You know what mine is? CD metal detecting out of Boy Green. I love it, dude. Metal detecting for green. Dude, but you're basically... I'm going to say you're a pirate, but you're hunting for treasures, dude. You're hunting for treasures. I was put hunting for gold. Oh, I got you, green. <laughs> Ninja bear. Dipping on electric lemon. Oh, my God. This is so damn delicious. Top, top, number one flavor. Oh, shit. All right. 
Isn't it yum yum? Wait, I don't know if you just put it in. Because when you when you first start dipping it, it's, it, it's, it's a lemon flavored dip. But the more you have it in there, it turns into like a pastry. Like you get that buttery taste, dude. It's so crazy how dynamic those... Fat cuts, the best, guys. The pouches, don't get me wrong. They're fine. They're convenient. I'm, I got Golden Delight pouches right now. But, dude, the fat cut, dude. It's like butter. It's freaking butter. That's awesome, Ninja Bear. I'm, I'm glad you like it. The lemon swirl. What's up, Zach? How you doing? I am hot as crap tonight. I had a boy, Zach. Zach, how do you spend... Well, maybe that's how you like to spend your day off. Just high as shit. What's up, Justin? Days off? I'm fishing. Wow. That's very noble of you, Justin. I thought you would be doing a helicopter or doing some type of nympho comment that you normally give. But you gave an honest answer, Justin. I appreciate you, man. <laughs> Happy Friday, Justin. Welcome back, dude. <laughs> Gregory, my favorite way to spend a day off. Pack a fat of stokers. Okay, so you just like to pack a fat dip of stokers. When it, but you can do that every day. Greg, you can do that every day, dude. What else do you like to do besides that? I like, everyone likes, I'm sure everyone that's doing this, walking in the woods, spending time with family outside, working on the car, I'm sure they all got to dip in. But what do you like to do with a fat dip of stokers, dude? Let me know, man. Yo, what's up, Cody? How you doing, man? Yo, everyone, I'm officially beardless now. Best way to spend the day off is with my family. Or if I want alone time, I go hit some golf balls or take a walk and be with nature, then play Station 5. All right, so I'll write some major ones. Spend time. I want to see those before and afters, bro. That was so funny. We, we gave you a judgment on whether or not you should shave, should shave your beard. But um, with family, okay. Spend time with family and you know, I'm just gonna put golf. Golf, <laughs> PS5. <laughs> Attaboy, Cody, hope you're vibing tonight, dude. I hope the family's doing good, dude. Love, Mr. Mofo. Love playing retro video games on my days off. Mr. Mofo. What systems, bro? What systems, man? It's been a while since I played some retro. I mean, I got a classic NES here with some games, man. But it's been it's been a while, man. But I'm I'm putting you down for retro, man. Are you drinking like some of that n nostalgia drinks too, bro? You drinking like a Capri Sun or a Sunny D? Taking it back, bro. Cody booby time. <laughs> if you guys don't know this, Cody's wife, if you weren't here yesterday, Cody's wife gave him an ultimatum. You either shave your beard or there's no boobies. Cody shaved that night. <laughs> he shaved that night, dude. What's up, JD? How you doing, brother? JD, what's your ideal way to spend your day off, man? What's your favorite way to spend your day off? Let me know, man. <laughs> Oh, I got you, Jaden. A lot of you guys spending time with family. And fishing. I can totally see how fishing is like a relaxing thing to do. Just be out in nature. Shit, the friends I have here, man, they just get hammered, man. I don't know how they can do that. <laughs> I am, dude. I am. Once deal or no deal is done, I am getting low, low, low. Lil John says hi. What's up, little John? How you doing, man? <laughs> That's Jaden's little bro, man. JD, my favorite way to spend the day off is to do at least one thing productive, whether that's a project or improving myself in some... Damn. I love that, JD. I love that, dude. I love that. So I'm just going to put Oh 
I'm going to put personal growth. I love that, JD. None of you guys are like, I want to go get massaged. I want to freaking go to my favorite restaurant. But I get it. I get it. You guys, I don't know. I mean, I, I, I need to think about this one. How would I? I don't remember the last time I... Yeah. No, it's wild, man. But I love that, dude. I love that. Right, Cody? He's vibing, dude. JD's vibing, dude. He's elevated as shit. It's good because I can get as high as I want to. What, playing disc golf? <laughs> playing disc golf, dude? <laughs> Congratulations, Robert. What, Rob? Robert's not here. Beefcake ain't here. Is he here? Is he here? What's up, Rich? How you doing, dude? What's up, man? What's up, Jay? How you doing, dude? You vibing, dude? How do you like to spend the day off, dude? <laughs> you vibing, man. I know you're vibing. Skateboarding, Stillman says. I don't know how you do it, man. How old are you, Stillman? How old are you, dude? I think once you hit like freaking 30, dude, skateboarding is just ridiculous. What do you mean skateboarding is 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 your job? Are you like a pro skater? What's going on, Stillman? You never said anything that you're like a sponsored dude or or how is it your job? You're following your passion, which is dope as shit. But, dude, that's bitching if you can make that shit your job. Yes, I can, dude. Yes, I can, brother. I'm here, man. I'm here. I'm just working my way down, dude. I'm going from all the oldest to the newest, so I'm just working it down, brother. Yeah, that's stupid. That's still, that's still way too expensive, dude. And back in Cali, I was paying 13 bucks for a roll. You're paying 30? That's way too expensive. I mean, I'm paying freaking 50 now, but yeah, it's ridiculous. Paul, I got it. That's lovely, dude. Could you read that? There we go. Fishing with daughter. Beautiful, Paul. I love that, dude. <laughs> Elena, you're lying, Elena. You're lying. Drinking. Are you dreaming while you're while, while you're drinking? <laughs> I got you, Elena. <laughs> Paul, I love that. Yeah, isn't that beautiful? A lot of you guys, there's like four of you guys that already said fishing. That's freaking awesome, dude. That's freaking awesome. If I could spend the day off, it would be going to a gay bar with Elena. And my hubby is our DD and chauffeur. <laughs> I got gotcha, you, Ninja. Um, <laughs> going to... Gay bar with Elena. Hubby is, how do you even spell chauffeur? I got it, Ninja. Fire Nation. <laughs> awesome, David. What's up, David? How you doing, dude? Just riding around, right? Just... Cruising. Dude, my riding is so bad. I'm just going to write what you said. How long do you normally ride for, man? Like, I, I know Renee, if you're still vibing with us. Whenever you ride with your boys, 
Is it like a 20, 30 minute thing? Or is it like an hour, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight hour cruise, man? Like how long do you guys ride for, man? I'm just curious. I'm just curious. I'm a full-time mom. My day off doesn't exist, but I don't mind. My boys go where I go and we have a blast. You're living the life, Ninja. You're living the freaking life, man. That's beautiful, Ninja. That's beautiful. <laughs> Fisher, you're lying too, bro. Stop lying, bro. But I'm gonna write it down, Fisher. I got you, dude. Watching you were outlaw videos. <laughs> Watching CD1 and outlaw videos. I got you, dude. I got you, Fisher. <laughs> Squiddy Zion, do I use snooze? Yes, I absolutely do. I do. Right now, I have the American snooze shit. I got some Siberia, just like I showed earlier. If you guys are just joining us now, the first, I think I started the five minute video, like in the four minute mark of this live stream. You can go back and I can show you the tour or of, of the uh, freezer. But yeah, I do. If you guys haven't done so already, like the video. Drop a like. What's up, Mighty Oregon, dude? How you doing, man? How's everyone doing tonight? Just wanted to say hi. Dipping on that sash clear heading off though. Sick tonight. Got to get some sleep before work. Holy shit. Is the sickness going around, mighty Oregon? Anyways, brother, thanks for stopping by. I hope you feel better, dude. And I'm assuming you're working tonight, man. I'm assuming you're a night worker, dude. Vibe out, man. I hope you get better, dude. Hell yeah, we bring coolers. That's a fun part about it. Hell yeah, man. You're vibing playing disc golf, dude. Trent, a couple months ago, Murphy's Gas Station, they had a deal going on for Cougar Wintergreen. Buy a roll, get a roll for free. And I bought four of them. And I got four for free. And I spent $50 a... Bro, Trent, that's like the freaking deal of the century, dude. If there was a buy one roll, get one free, I, I would dump so much money, dude. I would take advantage of that. But you did it right, dude. You bought four rolls, bro. You got four rolls for $50? Really? It's like 12 bucks a roll. That's ridiculous. Hell yeah, Trent. You did it right, dude. Eight rolls, bro. That will last me two months. No, no, no. A little under two months. I go through a can a day. But shit, if I could, I, I can let... I could possibly let five cans last a week. But on the weekends, I'm dipping way much. I'm, I'm dipping like a can and a quarter, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I like, you, you mods are awesome. Squiddy Zion, welcome, brother. Evening, Squiddy Zion. Squiddy? Squiddy? <laughs> ah, Tim, I got you for the Miata. Preventative maintenance, being the second original owner. That's dope, dude. My younger brother, Andy, he wants a Miata. He's like, after the kids are grown, he's gonna get his Miata, dude. <laughs> Dude, the new Miatas or the newer Miatas, they actually look pretty dope, dude. Tim, fishing for Pooty. Pooty smells like fish, stay away, Elena. <laughs> Renee's low and in flow. Wait, Renee, wait for me, dude. I'm, out, I'm gonna join you, dude. I have sent you the before and after pictures, but Colson's literally came up and just rubbed my face and was saying, Daddy, all questioning it. Bro, that's right. He's pretty young. Bro, have you guys seen like those compilation videos of like the freaking dads shaving their beards? And then they're, they're really young kids getting the, the, the mom or the, or, or the dad will film the kid's reaction and all they do is cry, bro. They straight up cry. They think it's a stranger. They think it's a completely different freaking person, dude. That's crazy, dude. And it's sad because these kids, dude, it's a thing, dude. Go to YouTube, put Dad Shaves Beard compilation or something like that. It's freaking hilarious. Maybe we can maybe we can watch them together tonight after uh, 
Live Vibers Spotlight. I, I could show you guys some of this compilation and we can react to it. It's the cutest things though, man. It's the cutest freaking things, dude. Mr. Mofo, I have a... Damn, dude, you got them all. I have an NES, SNES, N64, Sega Saturn, Atari... You got the Atari U. Man, that's all. PlayStation 1 and more than I probably should have. Lucky. The Sega Saturn, dude, never really took off, dude. No, no, wait a minute. Sega Genesis was the console. Sega Saturn was... I'm thinking of Dreamcast. The Dreamcast. Sega Saturn. Was that the... No, no. That was the Game Gear. Which one's the... Sega, why am I having a brain fart on the Sega Saturn? The Sega Genesis with the cartridge, right? Sonic. The Game Gear. Was Sega Saturn a disc and not a cartridge? Regardless, dude, that's bitching, dude. That's bitching, man. Oh, what's up, Robert? How you doing? Robert's in the house. Horror movie marathon. Going on a trail somewhere with the fam. Exploring and thrift shopping. Or yard selling. What? a hey, do, live vibe. Happy Friday, he says. Dude. I love thrift shopping, dude. I love thrift store shopping. Yard sales too, man. I used to go to this this swap meet in San Diego called Kobe Swap Meet. It's still running wild, man. But I I I love shit like that, dude. You can find some hidden gems, dude. Hidden gems, you can get some damn socks for cheap there too, man. <laughs> but I like that, Robert. Or beefcake. Hey, I'm always down for a horror movie marathon too, though. Wait, Harrison is running a marathon on tomorrow, I think. I think he said yesterday. My brother says he goes antiquing. He goes to antique stores. And I always thought antique stores and thrift stores were the same thing. But apparently, an antique shop is where you get, like, I don't know, antiquities. And they're actually priced like what they're worth. Like old shit. Just not like a thrift store is just like secondhand shit that people just donate. And 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 tea shop actually has like more expensive, more higher price stuff. At least that's how he explained it to me. But that's bitching, Robert. Family exploring as well. Alright, Stillman, you're 30, bro. That's bitching. I don't know how you do it, dude. I don't know how you do it. I don't remember the last time I actually fell down or slipped or fall or tripped on anything. But at my age, bro, bro, I am breaking a freaking butt cheek, dude. Happy Friday, Robert from Ninja Bear. She's toasting, dude. She's toasting. Smash that like button. Absolutely, Robert. If you guys are vibing, smash that like button. We have more responses here than we do likes on this freaking vibe right now. <laughs> Blockchain, what's going, dude? What's going, bro? What's good, y'all? Happy Bitcoin having day. The current block, the current blocks being mined was just cut in half. What do you mean by that? The current blocks being mined was just cut in half. Does that mean that the Bitcoin, that coin is worth more? If that's the case, you're vibing, right? I don't know, man. You're going to have to explain that for me, dude. On my off days, I like to hang out with boys and drink CD. There we go, Andrew. Thank you, dude. Hanging out with the boys. Speaking of the boys, when is that freaking season four, I think? Season three going to come out for the boys. That's a fun-ass show to watch. And drinking. I got you, Andrew. Hell yes, dude. Robert, it's your birthday today, is right? Today, right? Yeah. It's Robert's birthday. Everyone wish Robert a happy birthday, too. If you're vibing in chat, dude. It's his freaking birthday, man. Yes, I'm a professional skateboarder and trying to get some more sponsorships. Hell yes, Steelman. Bitching, dude. Hell yes, man. Everybody, please take a moment. To sing Robert a very happy birthday. <laughs> Shh, 
Jaden, I don't judge. <laughs> Bullshit, Robert. Bullshit, bro. <laughs> oh, yeah, Renee. That's a long time, Renee. That's a long time just to go cruising, dude. But that sounds like fun, dude. Like, if I was riding a motorcycle with, like, say, like, a, a friend or two, what would it, I would like to, like, ride for an hour and a half, two hours, park, go to a nice restaurant, eat some good food, and ride home. Fisher, I really like the dip run. Hey, man, I'm glad you like it, dude. I hope... Yeah, it's a little... <laughs> It's a little cringe for me to watch it, being, you know, my age now, but I'm, it was fun. We had fun filming it, dude. We had fun filming that movie, man. <laughs> Thank you, Ninja. Freaking Robert. Freaking Robert. <laughs> Birthday helicopter video coming soon, Robert. <laughs> Rushes to make store space on phone for helicopter <laughs> <laughs> you guys are too much, man. You guys are wild, bro. Yes, Dark says. Ty, what's up, dude? How you doing, man? Ty, let me know, dude. Let me know. Oh, actually, you can't even see the question. What's your favorite way to spend your day off, Ty? Happy Friday, brother. Chris goes to swap meets to buy cheap socks. That's neato. <laughs> I don't go to buy cheap socks. It's just one of the things that I always remember at Kobe Swap Me. The first row, when you make a left, they will get freaking just stacks of socks. Like, you know, these people. Calvin Klein underwear, socks, shit like that, man. But I always like going to the back side of the Swap Me because that's when you get, like, the used stuff. When you just get the people unloading their trucks with, you know, toys, vinyl records, sporting equipment, golf clubs. You know, shit like that. Dude, I want to go to a freaking... I want to go to a freaking flea market. I wonder if there's any here... In, there's got to be some in Florida, right? There's got to be flea markets around. What's up, Ann Jones? Ethan. Ethan Jones. He's dipping that grizzly straight. Right on, brother. Right on, Ethan. I hope you're vibing tonight, man. I like going to a bar and going for sushi with Fire Nation. Well, I'm going to put adding sushi... I love sushi. Well, I like rolls. Philly rolls, Cali rolls. Getting some hot and sour soup. Oh man, I love hot and sour soup so much, dude. <laughs> yeah, the thrift shops, you can find diamonds in the rough. Antique shops are priced for their worth. Rip-offs, bro. But antique shops have some sick shit. They got the badass shit, dude. Knucklehead, what's up, dude? Hope you all are thriving. Well, that's a nice gesture, dude. What's up, Knucklehead? Happy Friday, man. Welcome back to the live vibe. I hope you're having a good one, dude. Sushi Ninja says she's vibing with it, dude. She's vibing with it. Knucklehead, let me know, man. How do you like to spend your day off, dude? What's your ideal thing to do, man? And listen, Robert, but mostly girlfriend. <laughs> Greg's jumping in on the action. Ty is jumping in on the action. Riley Rush. What's up, dude? Been watching you for years. Keep up the great content. Thank you, Riley. Thank you, Riley. Welcome to the live vibe, my friend. We do this Monday through Friday at 9 p.m. Eastern. The first 10 minutes of this live vibe, I give the live vibers here a tour of my freezer, all the fabulous dip that we have, that I have. We're now headed to the question of the day, which is... What is your favorite way to spend your day off? After this, Riley, we play Deal or No Deal. We try to break our record. And then we do Live Viber After Dark. Or Live Vibe After Dark. And that's when you guys share your photos to all of other Live Vibers. We're vibing tonight, man. We're vibing, dude. But welcome to the Live Vibe, Riley. Raymond, how you doing, dude? Raymond, how you feeling, brother? What's new, man? What's new? We miss you, Raymond. We miss you, dude. I'd go go <laughs> I'd go bar hopping anyway with you with Lena Bear. I think Elena would be such a fun person to get shit faced with, dude. I think Elena would be 
freaking awesome to party with, man. But also, you know what? There'd be two people that I would be afraid to party with, and that's Robert and Liz, off the bat. They've gotten to be drunk on the live vibe with me not even being with them. How do they, how do they make that shit happen, dude? But I think Elena would be a blast to party with. I would actually like to watch a football game with Elena. <laughs> CD, no, time flies. Oh, I'm sure it does when you're out there having fun, dude. That's bitching, dude. Ty, riding my motorcycle. Another one, right on, dude. You know which bike looks really cool? Was the the Daryl bike from The Walking Dead. He had some like I think dirt tires on it. It, it just looked bitchin', dude. That bike looks so sweet. One sock will say USA and the other will say Mexico. Well, they're all from Mexico, bro. All that shit's from Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> there was always a Mexican selling the socks, bro. <laughs> Free mockers are so fire, dude. We went to a big one in San Jose, California. They are, dude. And then you get like the Mexican vendors selling like the the elotes. You guys don't know what that's it's a corn on the cob. And they put like butter on it and like hot sauce on that shit. They make churros. You get fruit cups. You get some carne asada. You get a burger, dude. It's cheap as shit. CD, on Tuesday, drive to Sweden. To, and buy suits. Dude, on Tuesday, you're driving to Sweden. How far is Sweden from Denmark, dude? But that's bitching, dude. Hell yes, Renee. Take some pictures, bro, so we can share it for the fellow live vibers, bro. Yeah, the antique shop's got the good sh shit. Wait, antique shop's got the good shit. I'm just t talking crapola because I can't afford those shops. Bro, you're making it sound like they're like $2,000 items, bro. I'm sure I can, I can get a $5 item in an antique shop. The way I see it is that an antique shop will have something for $30, $40. But if you were to see that at a thrift store, it'll be like $5. Cool stuff here in Old Town Temecula, antique-wise. No, go ahead. You live in Cali, dude? My sister lives in Temecula. I lived in the Corona for 10 years, but I'm originally from San Diego. I'm assuming you mean Temecula, California, dude. That's bitching, though, dude, if you're in Cali. Rusty, welcome back, dude. What's up, CD1 and everyone? How I like to spend my day off is taking a nice drive or running a power saw to cut firewood. Hell yes. A nice drive. <laughs> power saw. To cut wood. Some manly shit, dude. That's some manly shit, Rusty. I love it, dude. I love it. Renee, you don't like sushi? Dude, you don't like sushi? Come on, Renee. I bet you there's a roll out there you might like, bro. I don't like that that still moving type of sushi shit, bro. I, I, I get the artificial crab meat with some avocado and cucumbers inside wrapped in seaweed and rice. It's delicious, dude. It's delicious. But they got some, they got some fried shrimp shit, dude. Like tempura roll. Dude. When you get a roll that's like a deep fried roll, dude, and it's like lobster, like a lobster. Oh, bro, you guys are making me hungry. We're not even an hour into live vibe yet. Also, skull apple, Levi Garrett, moist snuff. Oh, that's that's what you're dipping in that time. boy. Stop puking on the sushi, Renee. <laughs> Salute, Chris. Taking the week off. Went to Disney with the girlfriend. In her to girls tomorrow headed to up then you just kind of cut off their knucklehead unless I miss tomorrow headed to 
Uh, I think this might have been your first comment en entering here, dude. But that's bitchin', dude. You went to Disney. Okay, so you're definitely at Temecula, California. But that's dope. You went to Disneyland with, with with your girl, dude. I'm trying to f see where the... Everything's all scattered here, knucklehead. Hope, okay, I'm finding your comment here. Hope your Friday's been chill, man. Oh, definitely, dude. Took the week off to went to Disney with a girlfriend and her two girls. Tomorrow, Laughlin for a wedding. Not looking forward to the heat. Well, it's April, dude. It, I've been to Laughlin, like, when I was a kid. My dad would take me and my brothers to Laughlin. And, but, dude, back then, there was, like, five hotels, six hotels. And we always stayed at, we always stayed at the Flamingo, dude. But, again, this was, like... 30 years ago about 30 years ago I have heard because they got that dam there and they got that lake you know where people ride and do all that shit out there in that lake bro I heard it's popping I heard they have like a Caesars maybe out there but dude you're vibing knucklehead hell yes man hell yeah brother I hope you have fun man Liz happy Friday Chris and the live vibers Love going on an adventure with the girls and getting ice cream or going to eat somewhere as a family. Even though our girls act crazy as hell. You know, they say they get it from their mama, Liz. They get it from their mama. <laughs> I'm sorry, Liz. But they do get it from you, right? They're getting it from you or from Beefcake. So, I don't know. Robert, who do they get it from? Do let me know, man. <laughs> Liz, the live vibe mom. Yes. <laughs> Liz, my forever girl. Don't worry, CD. Whenever we get drunk, me, Justin, and Logan will babysit you. Uh, I don't, what? What's with the side ice, bro? What do you mean babysit me, dude? I'm afraid of you guys, bro. You guys going to freaking spike my drink. I'm going to end up with my freaking pants around my ankles. I, don't, I ain't trusting you guys. I'm opening up my own damn bottles, bro. Not if you three guys are hanging together. <laughs> I saw... <laughs> oh, I miss having ice cream. <laughs> I freaking love ice cream, dude. Raymond, rock climbing and woodworking. Two of my favorite... I did not know that about you, Raymond. Hell yes, dude. <sighs> rock climbing's tough, dude. You need... That's... You need a strong back, bro. And shoulders and arms. But I love that dude, rock climbing. And woodwork. I love that Raymond. That would be my number one hobby, probably. Like if I could ever retire, right? I would like to just do woodworking. Work with wood. Build desks. Freaking coffee tables, bitchin' ass chairs, work with all types of wood. Oh, that'll be so just therapeutic, man. <laughs> Christopher, you're gonna hang out with us and have an awesome time, okay? I won't let Beefcake get you drunk. <laughs> That's impossible, Liz. I get drunk off of three beers. I'll be drunk after one, probably. I gotta work up to that. <laughs> we can just get a little high. I'll be fine with that. We can take a little trip. <laughs> Elote with tahin. Damn right, Ty. <laughs> Liz, you'll make sure none of the guys tea back Chris. Whoa! What is going on, dude? What is going on, man? Where are you guys going with this shit, dude? I didn't sign up for this shit. I didn't sign up for this. Why y'all bullying me? Actually, Ninja's the one sticking up for me, which is beautiful. It's beautiful. Will you do... Will you be doing more gaming lives, Miss Packing 1 and playing along? Will you be doing any more gaming lives, Miss Packing 1 and playing along? You mean gaming with uh, subscribers? Not anytime soon for that, dude. Um, I'm, I'm giving myself one day a week to, to
to play some video games. But the gaming videos, I don't know if you were here earlier, Riley, but Dying, I keep saying Dying Light. Dead Island 2, Part 1, Me, Spets, and Jesse. It's coming out this Sunday at 8 p.m. Eastern. The gaming videos are back. If that's what you're asking, yes, they are back and they start on Sunday. Been to Mac dude, I love Temecula, bro. I love Temecula, man. I love it there, dude. It's perfect, dude. It's not like you're not far from San Diego, right? And you're and you're not. I mean, you're probably an hour and a half from LA, but it's right off the 15, dude. It's beautiful, man. It's gonna be hot over there, yeah. Holy shit, Kenny Tucker. So you buy underwear with shit stains on? Bro. <laughs> I noticed you got your profile picture, Tucker. Attaboy. Secondly, bro. They sell new shit at Swap Me, bro. They sell new stuff, bro. It's, <laughs> just because it's a Swap Me doesn't mean it's used, my friend. And why in the hell would I buy used underwear at a Swap Me? I am talking socks, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you go to Cali this summer, Elena? Elena, you're going to love it. You're going to want to move to Cali, basically. If you go to Cali, you're going you're gonna to love the weather. You're going to love it. You've never tasted lobster, Renee? Are you? Wow. It's like my, one of my favorite foods. Lobster and crab legs. Hey, man. Never say never, dude. You got to try it one day, dude. Renee, brother, you're missing out. I love lobster. See, Raymond knows, dude. Raymond knows lobster is awesome. <laughs> it's not good. It's not delicious. It's, just, it's awesome. The live vibe sexy mama. <laughs> yes. Yes, Liz. <laughs> Cue the Shawn Michaels theme song. <laughs> lobster BLT. Anyone? Yes, Knuckle. Yeah, bro. I'll take one. I'll take one right now, dude. I remember going to I remember going to Costco when I was a not a kid. It was a while ago. But you know how the people with the carts, right? They give you the free tasters. There was a lobster bisque. Brisk? Bisque? Bro, I bet you freaking. I wonder if Logan. I wonder if Logan. He did he works with the meats. Dude, he made like a creamy potato type of soup that looked delicious as shit. But I wonder if he can, how he is working with lobster, like a lobster bisque or something. Girlfriend is not Fire Nation. She is Earthbender. <laughs> the chicken and shrimp tempura roll is the best, followed by a pink lady roll. Bro, they have chicken? They have chicken rolls? What is it, fried chicken on a roll, bro? Riley, where are you? Riley, where are you eating sushi? I thought it was all supposed to be like, I don't know, seafood type shit. I've never seen a chicken roll. Shrimp tempura, oh, lovely. I don't know what a pink lady roll is, though. Maybe salmon? That might be a little salmon. <laughs> Dark Hills, heck, sign me up, dude. See, Knuckles offering a lobster BLT anyone, man. Hell yes. I'm a meat man. Well, seafood is still meat, brother. It's just a different form of protein. Bro, you get a fucking... You get a lobster, bro, or crab legs, and you dunk... See, you slam dunk that shit with some melted butter, bro. Yeah. Oh, my God, dude. It's so good. You see these crazy-ass videos on, on Instagram with these Asian chicks, right? I don't know if they're in Japan or whatever, but they get these massive king crabs, dude. The claws are like this big, bro. They snap, and it's just like, ah, I'm just like, you son of a bitch, dude. It's delicious, man. You guys are making way too damn hungry. You need to come to my, you need to come to my party with some Renex. Come to my end party. What, come to your state and party with some Renex? I partied with some Renex before. I partied with some hardcore Renex, bro. 
Why should I party with your Red X, bro? What's up? What do you guys got to offer me? You guys do cake stands and shit? You guys do, like, line dancing? You guys go mudding? Let me know, bro. I'll vibe with you, Paul. I'll roll out, bro. We go fishing. First off, Paul, I don't even know where you live. <laughs> wow. Raymond says, Elena Roberts probably still sore from getting pegged the other night. Damn. Dead Island, the nostalgia. Dude, it's good. It's, it's Dead Island 2. I never played the original Dead Island. It's Dead Island 2, and it's freaking awesome. Right now, I got about a 20 minute, 25 minute gameplay. Maybe it'll be like a 22 minute gameplay on Sunday, but the first cut's done, man. Fisher says, Happy 420, everyone. Hope you all get the movie. The dip run. It's actually really good. <laughs> it's actually really good, guys. <laughs> no, it's actually. Bro, it's good. No, it's playing. Um, I'm sure most of the people here have seen it, dude. If you guys haven't seen the dip run, it's 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 available in like iTunes. Amazon. What's up, OBX? How you doing, dude? OBX, let me know. What's your favorite way to spend your day off, dude? Elena, there's only one type of fish I like, Raymond says. I get it, dude. I get it. I like all kinds of fish, though, man. Yeah, Kenny, he's talking you socks, bro. <laughs> I am not. Beautiful day here in Temecula. Heat is coming, though. I know, dude. Same for Florida, dude. It was, it was actually 87 today. 87, dude. I'm going to turn dark, dude. I'm going to be really dark this summer. It's nice to be your own boss now, bro. I can do whatever the fuck I want. It's fucking beautiful. If I want to go out and suntan, I can do it. As long as I'm back here by 9 p.m. for the live vibe. <laughs> hey, sir. What's up, buddy? Welcome back. My favorite would be 100% working on my backyard track because, well, that's all I do. Come Saturday, uh, come sat 188 laps on it. Also, I'm staying in Orange Cali with a friend for two months this summer. Orange County? That's right next to Disneyland, bro. That's bitchin'. You gonna go to Disneyland? But Acer, that's dope, dude. So working on your backyard track, I love that. Take photos, bro. Acer, I don't think you, you, you stayed long enough for Live Ivers Spotlight, bro, but if you have an Instagram, dude, shoot me some photos. We like to share with fellow Live Ivers, but if you're working on your backyard track, bro, there's a lot of people here who ride bikes. Farquad would love to see your backyard track, dude. Welcome to all, Acer says. Hell yes, man. If you guys are vibing, haven't done so yet, do me a favor, like the video. It will be greatly appreciated. I love you all, guys. I hope you guys are vibing this Friday. We're going to have a great freaking night tonight. We're already an hour and six minutes in. I'm almost at the end of these comments, and we're going to get ready to play Deal or No Deal. Bro, you started it with that freaking lobster BLT, bro. I'm I had fun with I'm having fun right now, dude. They're saying it's better than the first one. I never played the first one though. By this point, the soreness has worn off, Ray. Holy shit. He's ready for a second round, dude. He's ready for the second round. Ah, you live in Southern Kentucky, dude. Hell yes, man. You're a real redneck, Paul. You're a real redneck, dude. I have some friends that live in Kentucky, dude. I don't know if you guys remember the old gaming videos, but there was this guy. What was his name? Jesus. Gatlin. Gatlin. He lives in Kentucky. Shit, K9 lives in Kentucky. Green, how are you spending your 430 tomorrow? <laughs> 420. The same that he's doing it now, spending the day with my daughters, going, going to so, he's going to be so low, absolutely. You guys, I'll say it right now, if you guys are following Darcy 
on Instagram. Tomorrow is his birthday. We start to see a happy birthday tomorrow, man. And also, it's Hitler's birthday tomorrow. <laughs> and it's 420. Actually, yeah, we're gonna. I'm gonna be low tonight, and it's gonna turn into midnight. So yeah, technically, I'll be foretwing it up with you guys tonight. Jason likes pee pee kisses on his days off. <laughs> All right, guys. Shout out Minnesota. Fisher's vibing in Minnesota. Hell yes. All right, guys. Awesome responses, dude. Thank you all who participated in this question. It's time, though. It's time. Who's picking the first case, man? Um, you know what? I'm going to pick a case. For Logan, who's not here tonight. We're going to pick his ex. <laughs> We're going to pick Logan's girl. His OG girl. Everyone, we're playing deal or no deal. Let me pick his case out of the way, though. This case is yours to keep unless you decide to sell it back. We're doing to the this banker. for Logan. Round one. Choose a case. What other girl he picks? I think he picks 19 or 17. We're picking 19. We're picking the redhead. We're going to hope she has a high case today, man. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, guys. I am taking this delicious golden delight. I'm packing me a fatty. What I, do I want? Uh, do I want to be spitting all damn game? No. Um, all right. I'll pack me some zone wintergreen. I'll do the long cut for Live Iver Spotlight. I gotta be on my A game. Alright guys, welcome to Deal or No Deal. This is Season 5. The record to beat, the record to beat tonight is a $500,000 case. We can do this tonight, guys. We can do this shit. If you pick the four, the five, or the $750,000 case, you're automatically to get disqualified, and you're gonna get sent to the kitty table. The kitty table is not a cool place to be. There's a butt plug. This is the Brittany and Elena table. All stages have a table. This is the table right here when you get your DQ. There's some shit balls, some crusty socks, some PP, a butt plug. Hornets, watch out for the hornets. You got man, bear, pig. You got some rats. Basically, this is the shit of freaking nightmares. There's a hole here, guys. And you see a creature peeking through. If you picked a million dollar case, you go to the freaking dungeon, dude. Here at the dungeon, you got P. Diddy Little Whittle. You got Sleepy Joe. You got Nancy Perouse. You got some demons. You got some scary shit. This is the dungeon. If you picked a one million dollar case, this is the table you'll be sitting at alone. This is what you get to eat. A rat. That's it. You get a rat to eat. That's all you get. This is the freaking room of nightmares. So do not pull the one million dollar case. Everyone else gets to be vibing at the big table, dude. This is this is where all the dreams come true. If you're picking good case, everyone right now is vibing at the big table. It is Friday night. All you can drink, dip. We got beef cakes. We got everything. We got Raymond here. Jaden's vibing. We got these hotties. We got Sama. We got Sama vibing, dude. And I got to make this arrow really tiny. But look at that. We got Logan's meat sausage right there poking out. So this is a party table. You're all partying here unless you pick a disqualified case. This is deal or no deal. If you're a little bit confused, don't be. Do not be confused. You'll learn as we play along. So we got the 19 case for Logan. Now, let's go. Trent, Trent's off the bat. All right, guys. 
Drop your case numbers. Let's get this shit going. Low case, baby. Excellent. Mm. Trent. Attaboy, Trent. Let's do this shit. <laughs> I need a good guinea pee, pee No. No, Justin. By this point, Robert does need the lube. He's wide open for... Oh, yes, he is, dude. <laughs> and he has no shame. His ankles are riding high right now. Still at number seven. Let's go, buddy. Oh, no. Ugh, Stillman, that's a high case. But well, you're good, Stillman. You're still vibing. That's not a DQ case. Awesome, Green. Hell yeah, brother. Yes, I will retake some pictures. It'll be finished 100% to... Oh, no shit. That's soon. Going for a Talladega vibe this weekend. Hell yes, Acer. Well, if you if you take them this weekend, dude, Monday, we do live average spotlight. We can share those photos late Monday, dude. Follow me on Instagram if you're not, brother. Justin. Justin is picking a case. I love it. He normally just waits at the kitty table doing the helicopter. Nice one. All right, Justin. All right. You're good. I want lower case numbers, guys. Left column. Left column. Paul Miller. 20s. Paul, you son of a... You, you did the Robert thing to me, Paul. There is no 27. I fell for it again. You guys need to stop putting 27 in the damn list. NC23. <laughs> That's what we like to see. All right, NC. All right, NC. Justin, at this point, if he sneezed, he's running to the back. <laughs> He sneezed out the butt plug, bro. He was sitting at the kitty table. Logan's girl, let's go. Absolutely, man. Knucklehead. Number 11. Excellent. All right, Knuckle. Good freaking case, dude. Renee. Come on, Renee. Be good. That's what we like to see. Renee, $5. Hell yes, dude. Hell yes. You're no picking deal. number 35,000. All right, guys. So let's look at our cases here. Remember, this case gets you disqualified. This case gets you... All of these get you disqualified. We got one, two, three cases from the right, two on the left. Let's get some of these cases. I know it's all by chance. But in order to break 500,000, we either have to have the 19 case be either 750 or... Or a million dollar case. But if we get an offer up to it, you know, we can get six, seven hundred thousand. We'll see. We'll see. Let's go. No deal. You came here for the money. Time for the next round. Mr. Mofo picks case number four. Let's do it, buddy. Oh, no. Shit. That's going to bring it down. That's not a DQ case, Mr. Mofo. It's not bad. Well, it's bad, but it's not that bad. Green, number 20. Let's go, Green. Excellent. Yes. Fix the best case, Green. K9's vibing with us tonight. What's up, K9? Hope you're having a great Friday, brother. Keep bringing those positive vibes, dude. Oh no! Son of a there bitch! Goes the no! Case. You're disqualified, K9, you son of a bitch. You didn't bring the positive vibes tonight. I am never gonna financially recover from this. K9, welcome to the dungeon! Say hello to P.D. the Whittle and Sleepy Doe. He's extra sleepy, K9. Extra sleepy. Let him have it, guys. Let him have it in the comments. He did it. He just blew his wad, bro. He's at the freaking dungeon. He pulled the $1 million case. The only case, bro. Out of all the cases, you had to pick that one, huh? Damn.
damn, I don't have any money to build K9. He's going to stay there, man. K9, just wow, dude. Wow. Oh, no. K9 to the dungeon. K9. Oh, one thing I didn't mention to the new people here. K9. This is your first time in my little blue book. Not only K9. Did you make it to my little blue book? This is everyone that's been disqualified for season five. He is a dungeon master now. You're in the dungeon, dude. You're in the dungeon, bro. If you guys don't know, let me list off the dungeon people. We got Denise, Moose, Gregory, Kenny, Trent, Green, and K9. I've all made it. I've all pulled the one million dollar case. Not cool, bro. Diddy's smiling a little too hard right now. Yep, I know. He is, dude. Look at him. <laughs> I swear the gas station done me wrong on dip. Then fail you. You didn't fail me, bro. You failed the entire live vibe, my friend. It's okay, K9. We love you. K9, call 911. Why not? Nathan, call 911. Help! Police! Help! It's okay, K9. If we break our record tonight, you'll be back at the big table. Everyone right now is, is vibing at the big table. We're all pointing at K9 right now. At the dungeon. We're all eating and drinking mead, bro. We are parting, man. We are parting it up. K9, K9. Keep saying MAGA keeps biting out of the hole. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So let's hope the girl 19 has $750,000. The big one's gone, guys. Our chances have just fallen dramatically. But let's see. Robert, picking number two the redhead. Oh, darn. It's okay. It's okay. That needs to be out of there anyways. That needs to be out anyways. Gregory, eight, let's go, baby. Nice one. All right, Greg. All right, Greg. That's, what's our offer here, guys? Come on, man. Forty-six thousand. Get out of here. You came here for the money. Time for the next round. All right. Bay, what do you got? Number six? Let's do this. Come on. That's yes! Like She's bringing only good vibes. All right. Liz! Oh, shit! Liz is participating. Come on, Liz. That's yes! Like <laughs> the sexy mama of the live vibe picked a great case. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> I used that emoji on Liz, the, the 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 nail emoji. That's great. Oh no, K9 to the dungeon. He's he's still vibing at the dungeon, dude. He's done. Daddy already got to him, and Sleepy Joe is finishing him off right now. <laughs> Andrew, case ten, dude. You're next, dude. Come on, Andrew. Be good, Andrew. We're still vibing, guys. We're, we're still vibing, dude. Elena's licking Sama's nipples. Wow, Elena. You gotta share it to everyone at the big table. <laughs> K9 shouting MAGA, but Sleepy Joe got the pillow and sound silencer. K9 running away. <laughs> Run away, K9. JD5, dude. Let's do this, man. Oh no! You blew it! JD! JD! JD, That's you are disqualified, my my friend. Welcome to the kitty table, JD. The good thing is that you're the first one at the kitty table. You get to pick to sit on the Elena chair or the Britney chair. Or you can sit underneath the damn table if you want. Watch out from Sam Scram, she's in heat, bro. Let JD have it in the comments, man. JD, this is your first DQ of season five. 
You made it to my little blue book, my friend. I'm sorry, JD. I am sorry, bro. Not JD, dude. Not JD. There is a plunger there. There's a beetle. There's some shit balls. Watch out for the crusty socks, though, dude. Watch out for them crusties, dude. Son of a Hufflepuff. I know, dude. I know. You did it to yourself, dude. <laughs> Come on. Thank you for the super chat, Dark Hills. Um, Logan said to tell you, 19 was a bad idea. <laughs> Oh, Logan, come on, bro. <laughs> That's not true. That's not true. That's going to have the $750,000 case, bro. We're picking case 19 in the second game, too, for Logan. We're doing it, dude. <laughs> JD, sorry. No nips and dips, dude. Hand it over and perhaps enjoy the refreshments of mayo and fish heads. <laughs> JD, no why? I know, man. I don't want to see JD at the kitty table. That just means we have to beat our record tonight, guys. That's all. Let's keep her going. Drop in your numbers. If you haven't picked a case yet, pick a case. Two more people can still get disqualified, though. Here for the money. Time for the next round. Raymond. Our boy. Come on, Raymond. Oh, dog. Fuck! <laughs> you blew it! I am never gonna financially recover from this. All right, Raymond. Congratulations. <laughs> she lives. <laughs> what? I could be well. She lives to spite me. Why would he do? <laughs> Who lives? She lives to spite me. Why would he do that? LOL. <laughs> she lives to spite me. Who? Who, Dark Hills? Aw, oh, missing Logan, my beefcake's boyfriend. I know. I know. I quit. <laughs> we're gonna win. Not in this game, bro, but we're gonna win. We're gonna win. Oh, not Raymond. No. <laughs> this might be. Hold on. Is Raymond in here? You know what? Dark Hills sent me two super chats. I'm doing an executive executive decision. These super chats from Dark Hills. You guys, JD, it's Friday, dude. JD and Raymond, welcome to the big table, my friend. K9, you're screwed. You're still at the dungeon, bro. I'm sorry, K9. You're screwed, dude. You're still at the dungeon. But K9 and Raymond are relieved from their duties. Raymond, no. I would highly recommend the Elena chair. As long as you pet the possums, they won't hiss. Liz, Robert is mine. I will fight Logan. <laughs> Three games? K9 wants, th he wants out. He wants out. Um, we'll see. We'll, we'll see, K9. It is Friday. It is Friday, my friend. You never know what happens on a Friday. We like to flow like water. Wee Freedom! Raymond and JD, you must thank Dark Hills. All right, guys. We cannot beat a record anymore. The 750. We're pretty much done for this one. So pick cases, let's get this one over with. Oh, K9, all right, K9. No, Adrian hasn't picked a case yet. Adrian, 25 Adrian, let's go. K9 wants out, but he can, nice there we go. K9, if it's under 100,000, you, you get one point. K16, let's go. Excellent. All right, K9, you got one more. Remember, you're in the dungeon. If you get one more case under $100,000, you get you you get out of the dungeon Come on, and you sneak you your way into the that. kitty table. Then you need another two cases that are under $100,000 to get out of there to the big table. Or we beat our record and you're automatically out. 
44,000. That's not good. Time for the next round. Reaper, pick another case, buddy. Pick another case. Jaden says, give me 21. All right, Jaden. Be good, dude. Be good. Nice one. Oh, <laughs> the last super chat was a copy and paste from Logan. She lives to spite me. Why would he do that? <laughs> well, if you can text Jade or if you can text Logan, tell him what case number we should pick for the second game. Dark Hills. I would greatly appreciate that, brother. Brother. What's up, 304? Welcome back, dude. Pick a case, 304. I hope you're vibing, dude. I hope you're vibing. Jaden, that, that was a good case, Jaden. K9, don't sit on that bat. Is there a bat in the dungeon? There's no bat in the... No, he's in the dungeon, dude. He's in the dungeon. What's up, big body? Welcome back, brother. I hope you're doing good, dude. I hope you're vibing, brother. Ninja Bear. 14. Let's go, Ninja. There we go, Ninja. There you go, Ninja. What if Logan's case, though, is a five... What if it's a half a mil? What if we tie it? That's it's a not a winning nice case. Offer. We cannot play the winning theme because we didn't win. But he could have tied it. 65,000. You came here for the money. Time for the next round. Bay picks 13. Let's do this, Elena. Live vibe queen. That's what we like to see. There you go, Elena. There you go, Elena. There we go, Elena. That's a pretty nice offer. Get out of here. Came here for the money. Time for the next round. Reaper 24. That's what we like to see. We're rolling, guys. We're rolling. How's the dungeon, K9? That's a pretty nice offer. Oh my god, K9's not even there. They, Nancy Perosi already swallowed him whole. K9's done, guys. Offers 107. You came here for the money. Time for the next round. All right. Trent. Number three. That's what we like to see. That's no, I'm scared nice you and Logan can have you can have your privacy. Ooh, me and Logan will be waiting. And look at Robert's wearing the freaking high heels, man. One hundred forty-seven thousand dollars, guys. You came here for the money. Time for the next round. All right, Kenny. I got you for twenty-two, Kenny. Below, Kenny. Damn it, Kenny. You're being revived even though you're a dungeon master. You're tied for first as being a dungeon master. That's All right, guys. Nice $230,000. Does the 19... Does Logan's 19... Hold up. No, we're going. Our record low... Our record low is $400. No deal. That's the spirit. Final decision. Which case has the higher dollar amount? Your original case or the final unopened case? All right, guys. It's either we're going to tie our record, which isn't bad for Logan, or that 19 is going to be a record low case. Okay. You're hanging on to your original case. Let's see what you got. Uh Oh, we suck that one, guys. Record low. We got our new record. <laughs> Why would he do that? Why would he pick 19? Well, we broke a record, guys, for this game. We got another game to play, though. We got another game to play. Don't break my record low. We 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 did. We did, JD. We did it, man. 
We beat a record, but it was a low record. Our record low is now $10. It's okay, Live Vibe. We're gonna continue. We got this shit. Effin' neat. <laughs> Logan said, pick case 14 for the next game. All right, dude. We got it. Drop your case numbers, guys. Let's go. Oh, Robert. We cannot celebrate that, dude. We can't celebrate that. That's no good, dude. Trent. I think I explained it to you already, buddy. It resets. If we don't break a record, like on Thursday, right? Say you were in the dungeon, and we start, you're out of the dungeon. There's nobody in the kitty table, nobody in the dungeon until we play again. So, since it's a Friday, if we don't break the record, K9 is stuck in the dungeon till Monday, till we play next. So, yeah, it's important that we win tonight. We win tonight. <sighs> Logan said pick case 14. Here we go, case 14. This case is yours to keep unless you decide to sell it back to the banker. Round one. So yes, in other words, Trent, yes, you're out of you're out of the dungeon, my friend. We're gonna start with NC with 23. Alright, NC, be good, buddy. That's what we like to see. Let's do this, boys. Let's do this shit, man. Gregory 10. Let's do it for Logan, man. Nice one. Atta boy, Greg. Green with Envy Weed, 20. Nice one. <laughs> we still broke a record, Logan says. Wee you. <laughs> vibe on, Silman, vibe on. Robert Liz said she has been training your... Oh! Whoa, Justin. <laughs> Oh, JD, what? JD, that's the first case, buddy. We got it for Logan. We got it for Logan. Pick another one, dude. Trent, number one. Oh, oh, you son of a bitch, Trent. Pick another case. That case has been doing you bad, my friend. You are disqualified. You blew it! Trent, now, now you're at the kitty table, my friend. I hope you enjoy it. Trent, you are now the leader of DQs for Season 5 with 4, my friend. You are the leader, Trent. You always pick case number 1, man. You gotta switch that shit up, dude. Now enjoy the kitty table, my friend. Enjoy the butt plug. It's been used tonight. Alright, guys. Trent started it off today, man. Nightly, she's been going berserk on me. Look at this. <laughs> the power couple. Steelman. K7. Same case again. Like Alright, Steelman. That worked out that time. K9. If K9's case is under $100,000, he gets out of the dungeon and into the kitty table with Trent. K9, be good, my friend. Be good. Nice one. All right, congratulations. You're out of the kitty table, even though you were there for a very long time and the damage is already done. Deal now you gotta suffer more. No deal. You're at the kitty table, K9. You and Trent are at the kitty table. $34,000. Come on. No deal. That's Come on, man. Time for the next round. Robert. Picking 19 this time. That's what we like to see. She was good to us. She be getting some low cases, man. Liz! With the big squirrel nuggies tonight. Oh. It's okay. It's a hundred thousand. At a girl, Liz. Dark Hills case number six. Be the one, baby. Be a low case. 
not bad, not bad. That case needs to be out of there anyways. Jaden. Oh, God. Jaden's going back to his 12. That's what we like to see. Yes! All right, Jaden. You're vibing, dude. You're vibing. If you guys haven't done so, like the video. Give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you. Happy Friday to all. I love all the live vibers vibing with us uh, tonight. We're kicking ass, man. We're, we're going to break this record, dude. Jaden, hell of a case, my friend. Justin. Oh, second case. Woo-wee! Like see. see, Justin, you gotta play more, man. I know you're hoping for the pee, -pee kisses and all, bro, but come on, man. You're good. You're good at this game. 75,000. Let's keep going. JD. Throwing in his luck for case 26. It's okay. It's okay. That's not a DQ case. You're very close, JD. You're very close. Tie picks case 13. Let's do it. Excellent. Atta boy, Ty. The best case. He got the best one, dude. Reaper. 25. That's what we like to see. Great case, Reaper. Hell yes, dude. Oh no, Trent called. Yeah, he's. Nathan, call 911. Help! Holy! Trent's loving Help! it, dude. Trent and K9 are loving the KD. Which? K9, what table? What chair are you sitting at? Trent? Well, Trent was there first, Trent. Trent, what table? What chair are you sitting at? That's a stupid case. I'm not picking that case no more. I told you, Trent, you're leading in DQs. You're always picking that number one case, man. Ninja Bear Fire Oh shit, Fire Nation. Gotta pick another case. Kenny! Kenny! Come on, Kenny. Alright, like Kenny. See. Good case, Kenny. Good case. 21. Oh, Robert's picking 22. We got you next, Robert. What's our offer here? That's Look, guys. Nice offer. There's two cases on the board that can beat our record. We got this. K offers 122. No deal. Alright, Robert's coming in next. I'm gonna grab another quick water. Robert, be good with that 22, man. Alright, Robert, be good. Nice. Son of a bitch, Robert. You killed it, buddy. You killed it, dude. Greg picking case three. Nice one. Yes, Greg. Let's go. Ninja Bear. Fire Nation. Oh. No, Ninja. No. You're disqualified, Ninja. Pretty nice offer. Fellow club member, fellow mod. Ninja, Ninja. Welcome with K9 and Trent. Ninja, you're at the kitty table, girl. Oh no, not, not, not Ninja. Ninja, you just tied Trent with the most DQs. Four, season five. Be nice to Ninja. She's badass. She's Fire Nation too, so don't talk too much shit. Ninja, how could you? So who, okay, now Ninja, you're the third person at the kitty table, man. I don't, I, I, I don't know where everyone else is sitting right now. It's, it's sad, it's sad, I know, Green. Have you won the million? Sorry, I left to play dinosaurs with Coulson. If you won the million, you, we wouldn't be playing this right now, dude. <laughs> no, not yet, not yet. Oh! Oh, I got two super chats for that from JD. Gotta play another one. And look at that, Ninja. Robert and JD both got your back. Thank you for the super chat, guys. Ninja, you're back with Sama. And Elena, we're all vibing at the big table. You're back, Ninja. You've been bailed out by Robert and JD Bellbonds. Incorporated. 
<laughs> no, that's what I said. I still love <laughs> Ninja, run! I just felt like running. She's Yeah, she's running back to the big table. She's good. I'm not going to talk shit. She might whoop. Yeah, Fire Nation will whoop your ass. Back to the big table, Ninja Bear. We love our ninja here. Absolutely, Cody. She's vibing, dude. Ninja, welcome back. Trent and K9. How's them fish heads tasting? K9 loves mayo, though. He's vibing with that Miracle Whip. I know he is. Oh my god, yes. Thank you, JD and Robert. You're saved. You're saved. All right, guys. We still have the $750,000 case and the $1 million case. Let's keep her going. Here for the money. Time for the next round. We need case numbers, guys. We need case numbers. Trent. Oh, Trent's sitting at the Elena chair. So K9 is sitting at the Britney chair. Not Q. Not Q. But Trent and K9, you can you can you can escape those tape the kitty table by picking two low cases that are under a hundred thousand. So go ahead and pick a case. Cody, pick a case. Whoever has not picked a case this round, pick a case. Let's go. <laughs> Y'all have the address. Address me at. You all have to address me as a Dino Dada. <laughs> I got you, dude. Dino! 16 for Cody. Here we go, man. Nice one. There we go. There we go. Oh, we got a super chat. K9, you've been bailed out. Come on. You've been bailed out by Steelman, dude. Is K9 even here? <laughs> He's probably... Hands deep in that freaking jar of Miracle Whip. K9, you've been bailed out by Steelman Bell Bonds. Congratulations, K9. You're back at the big table, dude. Just wipe the mayo off your face, man. Come join us. Have some beefcake. Have some mead. Have some Jack Daniels. Some Twisted Teas, buddy. You're back. Steelman Bell Bonds in the house. What's up, Turt Man? Welcome back, my buddy. He wants in down the action, dude. K9, if you're still vibing with us, brother, you're out. You're out of the kitty table, dude. Green, K17, let's go, dude. Five dollars, Green. Oh, by the way, did I forget to mention? Green has his metal detecting treasures here also at the big table. And Elena has her beautiful keg here at the table. Don't forget this. The big table, the Bahala table, has all the treasures of all the land. Thanks by Green's hard work and dedication, metal detecting. All right, guys. Our offer is $234,000. Two cases out of the six are record breakers. The million is we advanced to season freaking six, dude. Did Logan pick the case? We'll see. Are we gonna have to play another game? It's up to you guys. But we'll see. Definitely wouldn't want to fight Ninja. Maybe play Wrestle. <laughs> like I play fight and had a big brother. Ask Robert. I'm not that easy to take down. You want friendly wrestling. Friendly girl wrestling. You guys can be wrestling at the big table. Next to the strippers. <laughs> no deal. Come on, no man. Deal. Let's do it for Logan. For the next round. All right, Turpman, welcome back. I hope you're good, Turpman. Oh, no. Shit! Shit! No! I am never gonna financially recover from this. Come on, banker. You do better than that. Turpman, you're disqualified. I'm sorry, Turpman. Welcome to the kitty table. You're with Trent. You're with Trent, dude. Okay. This is hard. Terp man. This is... Well, you're a fellow live viber now. Oh, no. You've been a fellow live viber. This is your second DQ, Terp man. 
Turp Man, I am extremely disappointed, Brody. I'm extremely disappointed. Congratulations, Turp Man. Your second trip to the kitty table. All right, our offer is now, our offer dropped dramatically, guys. It's $173,000. Liz is too easy. I just don't put up a fight because, you know. <laughs> sure. She'll be whooping your ass, dude. Or she ain't gonna give me none. <laughs> Holy shit, Thor! The God of Thunder just made it to the live vibe. What's up, Thor? How you doing, buddy? Thor's rocking. Thor's vibing. <laughs> All right, guys. Who's next? Oh, snap. Liz is getting it. Yeah. I know. Trent. Trent, Trent. Trent wants out of the no kitty table. Time for the next round. Trent. The $1 million case is left, my friend. Regardless... If you get disqualified, being at the kitty table, you get sent down to the freaking dungeon. I hope you know that. Be good, Trent. I'm pulling for you, buddy. Yes, Trent. Trent, you have one point, Trent. One more case under 100,000, and you're at the big table, my friend. The offer now is $227,000. No deal. Let's go. Let's go. Time for the next round. Ninja accepted your challenge, Liz. Liz, what a gentleman. <laughs> Cody, I know. I just felt like running. Bueller. <laughs> now I'm all by myself. One more and you're out, my friend. Huffle Terp. <laughs> no! F. I know, Terp. You blew it, Terp. You blew it, dude. This sounds like a good... <laughs> Hey, while those two girls wrestling, I'm sure Justin and freaking Robert are going to be wrestling. Turp man, you're disqualified. Off to the kitty table. Routine is hand over the dip. And have a seat on the Britney. <laughs> In the Britney chair. Turp man, what the F was that, dude? Turp, I'm not mad you DQ'd. But I am disappointed you don't have a profile pic. Absolutely, Turp man. Turp man, you're the only one right now without a profile pic. Fix that, buddy. Put your favorite sports team. Put a picture of yourself, your favorite animal. Put a squirrel. Put a squirrel. Speaking of squirrel, where in the hell has Tyler been, man? Where's our squirrel nuggy at, man? My girlfriend said I'm sitting on the butt plug. All right. If your girlfriend is watching, here you go, Turp Man. Oh, shit, dude. Pop open. Oh, look, you just dropped the charity chart, dude. There you go, man. If your girlfriend is there watching you get disqualified, there you go. Oh, boy. Now I got to fix this. Hold up. <laughs> Sorry, Terp. Sorry, Terp. But uh, you're on the butt plug, man. A lot of people have placed their butt cheeks on that shit, dude. Paul, 24. Paul, be good, Paul. Please be good, Paul. Oh, Fuck! No! no! Case. Paul! Paul! You blew it! You blew it! I'm sorry, Paul. You blew it, Paul! No! Congratulations, you're at the dungeon. Watch out for P. Diddy the Widow Widow Will. Watch out, Sleepy Joe is extra sleepy. Don't drink whatever is in his cup. You got Nancy Pelosi. You got a bullwhip. Bro, you're going to be tortured here for all eternity for pulling that $1 million case. You freaking blew it, bro. You freaking blew it. Hufflepuff is right. Oh, no. No. Paul, my friend, this is your second disqualification, dude. 
And now, Paul, you've made it as a dungeon master, dude. Congratulations. Paul, you're now a dungeon master. You pulled the one million dollar case. Fubberknuck. I know, dude. Paul Miller, we're never gonna financially recover from this. I am never gonna financially recover from this. Paul, you're a great dude. But better you than me, dude. <laughs> no, Paul. No, to the dungeon. That's, this is horrible, guys. This is horrible. This is effing nuts, Paul. You were supposed to be the chosen one. Well, P. Diddle Whittle is diddling him now, dude. King Chris, what's up, dude? Welcome to the live vibe, dude. You got that rogue wintergreen. It's good, right? That rogue wintergreen's good, man. Welcome to the live vibe, dude. Man, that sucks. All right. On, banker. You can do better than that. <laughs> Logan, your case was pretty shitty, dude. <laughs> what do you guys think, dude? What do you guys think? Do we play one more? Do we just take this deal and play one more game? It's only 10.54. We can play one more game. I'm willing to do it. I'm willing to do it, man. Holds a rope at the door at the dungeon. Come on, Paul. I got you. Pull up. Nope. We're all family here. Nope. Cody's pulling a rope from here. He's not going to do it. Nope. He's in the dungeon, dude. He's in the dungeon. Liz, if you and girlfriend are wrestling, I'm getting into it. <laughs> I'm getting into it. Sleepy Joe drools. He does, man. He does. I don't know, guys. What do we do here? Take the deal. We're taking the deal. Deal. All right. Let's deal see what case Logan picked. Twenty-two thousand dollars. That was a good deal to take. That was a good deal to take. What? They got Ro Cappuccino now? No way, King. King Chris. That's awesome, dude. One more. Let's do it for Logan, dude. All right, guys. What case should we pick? What case number should we pick? Spread Eagle and then the Pile Driver is the ultimate KO ninja. <laughs> Dark Hills, can we get another case number for, for Logan? I know Logan can, picks K17 sometimes, I think. You gotta do it for Logan, dude. Someone come join me in the dungeon. They will, Paul. They will. If they pick the million dollar case, dude. If we get the million, we need to add that dude Spartan kicking down to the dungeon. Oh, absolutely. I'm writing a note on that, dude. I think it happened once in, in, in the live vibe, dude, where someone at the kitty table picked another DQ case and he got sent to the dungeon by doing that. There's only two ways to do it, man. All right, guys. Since this is the time... <laughs> Paul. Come on. Dark Hills Bell Bonds. Mr. Paul Miller gets out of that shit show dungeon. I feel Sleepy Joe smelling his head and Diddy is too close to the no-go hole. K-17. 
case 17 for Logie. All right, Paul, congratulations. That was a $5 super chat. So you're going to skip the kitty table. You're now at the big table, Paul. Thank Dark Hill Bell Bonds, dude. Thank you, Dark Hills. Thank you for the super chat, brother. K17 for Logan. We're doing it again, dude. We're doing it again. Paul salutes you, Dark Hills. All right, guys, let's do this shit. K17 for Logan. Decide to sell it back to the banker. Round one. Choose a This case. is hard, dude. I know you guys are going to be really shy to pick cases here, but it's okay. Cody, 26. Let's go, Cody. Oh, darn. Ooh. That one hurt. It's all good, Cody. We're vibing. 23, Turp Man. Like all right, Turp Man. All right, Turp Man. Wait, Turp Man's... Turp Man, one more case under 100,000 and you're out of the kitty table, dude. One more case. K9 and Paul were the first dungeon of the day. Oh, this is hard, man. K7, come on. There we go, Steelman. NC picking case number one. There we go, NC. Trent, that would have been a good one today, dude. In this round, knucklehead. We got you, bud. Number three. Nice one. There we go, knuckle. Ninja bear, be good. Oh, Son of a bitch! No! Ninja, back to back. Ninja. Or no deal. Ninja, you're now the leader again. Takes the lead. She, no, she took the lead. Yeah, she took the lead. She was tied with first with Trent, and then Trent tied her. Oh, one, two, three, four. Oh my God, this is your fifth one, Ninja Bear. Your fifth case, Ninja Bear. What's going on, Ninja? <laughs> Did he? <laughs> I'm scrolling down. I'm scrolling out the comments. Oh, hell, Ninja. Tonight. Just ate my night. Oh my god, how? Slimer. <laughs> it's okay, Ninja. It's the 500. It's the 500. Thor's running. I just felt like running. Ninja, we love you. But get some loot next time you die. <laughs> oh, stop, guys. We're gonna win this. We're gonna win this. No deal. Time for the next round. Justin, 15. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Nice one. There we go, Justin. I want to. I want to see you playing more, dude. Of course you can, Paul. Twenty-four. Don't suck. Excellent. There we go. Elena, case nine. Elena, case nine. Be good, girl. Excellent. Elena's solid, dude. Elena is freaking solid in this game. Ninja, you've been bailed out by Elena Bell Bonds for Ninja. Ninja! <laughs> Main reason why I never gamble. Fire Nation suspended my fire bending capabilities. But you got plenty of live hours out that love you, Ninja. Congratulations, you're at the big table. You're at the big table. Why are you running, Justin? We still I got time. Like we still got time. We still got time. Ain't, it ain't over yet, dude. It ain't over yet. All right. Who's next? Elena picked a great case. And she bowled out Ninja. Jaden. 21 Jaden. Oh. Ouch, Jaden. Ouch. <laughs> it's okay. 
Robert picking 19 again. B, B. All right. Robert, you're picking good cases tonight, man. You're picking hell of a good case, dude. That's a pretty nice offer. No oh, I gotta, I gotta scroll up. Thor. Picks case 10. All right, Thor, the god of thunder. Thor! Thor's vibing at the big table, baby. Thor's always vibing at the big table. Eight, I am scared. Don't be scared, Liz. Oh. Be scared, Liz! You blew it! I am never going to financially recover from this. Liz! Liz, now I know why you were scared. Oh, Liz. Liz, this is your first DQ season 5, Liz. That's not bad. That's nothing you should be ashamed of. That's nothing you should be ashamed of, Liz. You're, you're doing good this season. By the way, we got Denise, Trent, Jaden, Ninja, Junior, Moose, Adrian, Thor, Gregory, Dark, Kenny, Turpman, Ty, Paul, Green, CD1. You're tied with me. I got a DQ. Back, Mac, Zach, K9, JD, and now Liz. No bueno. No bueno. Gregory picks case four. Come on. One dollar. Oh, wait. I didn't even highlight it. Greg, you've been kicking ass tonight, man. You've been kicking ass. <laughs> And see, you already picked today, right? I think if we picked 23 friends, no, NC picked case one, I believe. Everyone needs the first shot first, dude. That's what we like to see. Green, green. He's lucky. He's lucky. That's a pretty <laughs> nice offer. Liz. You've been bailed out by Ninja Bell Bonds. Liz, you're back. You're back to the big table with your beefcake and all of us. Thank you for the super chat, Ninja. Liz, you did it. What do you mean exactly? Exactly what? Oh, that you were scared. Yes, I know. No Robert sausage for you, Liz. <laughs> yeah. I'm happy at the winner's table. I'm too scared to say to say more cases. I know. I've noticed that. Not you, but fellow live vibers. They don't want to blow it, dude. It's okay, guys. We are vibing, dude. Liz, you're good, girl. You're good. No deal. That's the spirit. Time for the next round. Hold up. We got a new live viber in chat. Ajax. What's up, Ajax? Ajax is outdoors. Welcome to the live vibe, buddy. Nice for you to join us here, man. You're gonna pick case 25? You probably don't know how this game works, but just pick a low number case, my friend. You'll be good. There we go, Ajax. Ajax is outdoors. Dude, hell of a case, man. Welcome to Live Vibe, brother. <laughs> Solid number snipe for Broski Logan. <laughs> yes, you? Yeah, hell yes you have. Elizabeth, no, you blew it. Dark Hills, 18. Excellent. Dark Hills has been killing it, dude. He's been killing it. All right, guys, we need some more case numbers in. NC, 13, let's go, dude. Excellent. All right, NC. That's how you do it, dude. You vibe in NC. That's a pretty nice offer. 160,000. You guys, we still got that 750 and the 1 milli. Both are record breaker cases. Come on. Came here for the money. Time for the next round. J oh, I think we already picked 21, J. Yeah. Yeah, we we picked that one. Greg wants case 5. Let's go, Greg. 
Excellent. There you go, Greg. All right. Trent, you got one point. You got one point, my friend. If it's under 100,000, you get sent to the big table, my friend, and you're parting with us. If you get a DQ's case, you're getting sent to the dungeon. Oh! Oh, shit! You're going to the dungeon, dude! Dude! Trent, you get sent down in the dungeon back with P. Diddy Whittle and Joe Biden, dude. You're vibing. It has to be under 100,000. Oh, actually, hold up. No, 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 no. My bad. You're not at the dungeon. You're not at the dungeon. My bad. That wasn't a DQ case. That wasn't a DQ case. But you did not get that point, and you're back to square zero. You need two back-to-back -back cases that are under 100,000. So, you're not sent to the dungeon, but you're still staying at the kitty table. Which is still a stuff of freaking nightmares, my friend. If you guys are vibing and haven't done so yet, please do me a favor and like the video. Let's get it going, guys. We're still vibing good. We still got the 750 and the $1 million case. We gotta break a half a million tonight for Logan. It is getting spicy. F it, risk it for the biscuit. What is it, Cody? Give me a number, buddy. Give me a number. We need numbers, guys. I know you guys. <laughs> Chris had Trent sweating. I know, dude. I know. <laughs> My bad, dude. I did the sound effect and everything, dude. I'm sorry, Trent. But you got to pick another case, dude. You got to pick another case. Absolutely. Boom that like button, guys. I need some case numbers. I'm gonna go take my you know what right now. Since usually this time we were doing live vibe after dark. Give me two seconds. We got the winners, Liz, with Elena, and I snuck out a bottle. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No sneaky sneaky. Trent had war flashbacks. He did, man. Cody. Oh, it's case two for Cody? I didn't see it. I don't see it here. Not in my chat, bro. All right, Cody. You said number two? All right, Case. All right, Cody. You got this, dude. Excellent. All right, Cody. All right, Cody. Atta boy, Cody. It didn't pop up for me, man. YouTube's been screwy, screwy, screwy. You guys. We almost have a 50% chance of winning. I'm glad you saw it, Dark Hills. Thank you, Liz. Thank you. Kenny? Oh no, Kenny. Alright, Kenny, be low, baby. Be low, Kenny. Come on, Kenny! Yeah, Kenny! There we go, dude. Give me a big number here, man. This is what our offer is right now, guys. Come on, we got this shit, dude. That's a pretty nice 370, guys. We have a 50% chance right now of breaking a record or cracking the freaking Millie. All right, I'm leaving this up to you guys. No I need deal. a tally. Time for the next round. I need majority here, man. I need majority here. 
I mean, I can let Green carry the weight of everyone and pick his case. Green's been good tonight. You know what? Let's do it. Sorry, Green. Sorry, brother. You're going to have to carry the weight here. You're going to have to carry the weight, Green. You've been good today, brother. The next round, though. The next round. The next round. All right, Green. Positive vibes. Oh, Fuck! Sorry, Green! Sorry, Green! You blew it! Nathan, call 911! I'm sorry, Green. You're at the kitty table, my friend. I love you, Green, so much. And Green, this is your second DQ. It's not bad, dude. Second DQ. I'm sorry, Green. At least you're really low right now. And I'm about to join you, dude, because I just took my you know what. <laughs> Oh no, Greens, I'm sorry, but not sorry because it wasn't the Millie. Hey, we can still win. No, Thor's angry at you, Green. All right, guys. All right. No deal. For the next round. 22 or 16. I need everyone to submit either 22 or 16. The one with the most is a case that we're going to pick. And then we go into the final case. So 22 or 16. Green is out. Shimon. Robert, thank you for the super chat. Green, you've been safe, dude. LOL, no need to show me where the gobby been there before. Green, congratulations, buddy. You made it, brother. You're at the big table now. You're partying with us, dude. You've been bailed out by Robber Bell Bonds. Or, I'm sorry, Beefcake Bell Bonds. Thank you for the super chat, Robert. You saved Green. Now Green is back with his treasures and shit, dude. All right. Ajax says 16. All right, let's tally him up. 16 or 22? Ajax, 16. Gregory, 22. NC, Andrew, Ninja, all say 16. Green, bro, I'm not angry. <laughs> Robert, thanks, my brother, says Green. All right, right now, 16 is in the lead, guys. <laughs> you guys are so scared. I know you are. I'm scared, too. We love you, Green. 16 or 22? Which one is going to have the low number? Right now, 16's in the lead by three, dude. Right now, it's looking like K-16. Ooh, that hurts. That hurts. 16 by Cody. That's five, but then again, we got 22, 22, 22. It's four to five right now, guys. Kenny says 16. All right, 16's the case. Winning by two. Oh man. Let's be low, guys. Let's be low. Let's do this. K16, let's go. Oh, Fuck! Oh, there goes the million dollar case. No! You blew it! 
Nathan, call 911. I am never going to financially recover from this. Oh, guys. That sucks. We could have we, we, we could have done it, man. We could have done it. Come on, banker. You can do better than that. You guys are offer now is $237. Logan picked either the $5 the $500 case or the $15 case. All right, Kenny, Cody, Justin, Ninja Bear, NC, Andrew, and Ajax all pick K16. <laughs> I knew it, Hufflepuff. No, Kenny, no. Season 5 is turning out to be a real Hufflepuffer to the sport. <laughs> All right, guys, everyone crab in and let's get the fuck out of here, dude. <laughs> you blew a Chris 22. No, 22 didn't win. 22 didn't win. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Well, yeah. One, two, three. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Well, it ended up being Ty, I think. You guys waited too long, man. You guys waited too long. You guys got to respond quick, man. This fucking sucks. We're taking the deal. Let's see what Case Logan got. <laughs> Like the banker wins this one. Oh man, we didn't do it tonight, guys. We're just gonna have to wait till Monday. Whoever stuck at the kitty table or the dungeon, you guys are there for the weekend, man. You're there for the long haul. And you won't be get out until we start Monday. Deal or no deal. <laughs> I love this comment. Season five is turning out to be a real huffer puffer. I know. I know. Boo! I know, Robert. I know, man. Oh, we took the deal, bro. We got Two hundred thirty-seven dollars, <laughs> Robert. Sorry, we didn't win for your birthday. <laughs> the plug's mine. Oh man, what, what? That sucks. Uh, that's not good. Cool to hear. What's up, King? My life was turned upside down today, but I'm here and I love you all. Oh man, I hope you're doing good, man. I hope you're doing good, King. We love you, man. Absolutely. Sending some lightning to the dungeon to hit Joe Puffy. And Nancy. Attaboy, Thor. King. Dark Hills are behind you and my, <laughs> my cop car. <laughs> Let me give you an escort. Yes, let's do it, man. King, love you, buddy. Shoot me a text or call me if you need a chat about it, man. I'm here for you. Beautiful, Dark Hills. That's beautiful, man. King. Oh, Kenny, you're good, Kenny. Don't worry about that. Two games in a row. Yeah, they were, they were both $500 cases, weren't they? We we just we need Logan's presence to win. The live vibe did not want us to win with Logan not being here to enjoy it. That's 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 how I see it. The king's in the house. King, you have my sword and my wrench. All right, guys. Let's go to live vibe or spotlight now. The lights are going to go low. I, I, I took my you-know-what about five minutes ago. And we're vibing now. So pull up a chair. Or not pull up a chair. Take a seat. And welcome to Live Vibe After Dark. Lights get low. Because we all get low tonight, baby. Happy Friday to everyone, man. If you guys haven't done so yet, please like the video. I love you guys.
dip pouch is going out, the long cut's going in, and I'm already feeling it. I'm already feeling the you know what. It just wasn't meant to be without Logan. Absolutely. We need Logan. We need Logan. Indeed, Ninja Bear. The live vibe reminds me of Lilo and Stitch quote. This is my oh, Ohana. It's different, but good. Yes, real good. <laughs> yes, dude. Pull up a strap on chair. <laughs> oh, Thor. Some roses for our women's. You're a romantic, Thor. Yes, let's get it low, low. It's 4.20 in the East Coast in about 26 minutes. 36 minutes. And some beers for the men. Hell yes, Thor. Pull up a plug. <laughs> Robert. Hell yes, happy Friday, guys. We love you too, Chris. I love all of you guys. Liz, you're great. You're great, Liz. All right, guys. Ooh, no, 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 no not that song. No, hold on, let me take these songs out. Uh, da, 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 da. We gotta put the live, the, the, you know, the chill music. All right, let me pull up my email. Welcome to Live Vibe After Dark, guys. We are doing Live Vibe Spotlight. Send me your DMs, show me your photos. I'm so late checking my freaking emails. <laughs> All right, first we got freaking Dark Hills. Hell yes. Hold on. Hold your horses. Guys, I just put a link where you can subscribe to this channel that I'm about to show you, Dark Hills European Mounts LLC, and also a link to a store where you can purchase one of his freaking beautiful projects that he does. Right now, he's showing us a short to share with the fellow live vibe. I am gonna mute. I'm gonna mute the music right now. But here we go. And he's rocking one of my shirts, which is dope as shit. So He's showing you guys how he hydro did. bucket or some sort of container. Look at that beautiful beard. With water, full of water. And then your paint. And what you're going to do is you're going to spray your paint in the center and alternate your colors. Just alternate. <laughs> you're probably going to end up spraying at least a quarter can that's a lot of paint more of each exactly color. that's a lot of paint a quarter of a can for for, and for, then for I one will zoom this in so you can see the hydro deck in action stay tuned <laughs> that shouldn't be an issue with the music That's a lot of paint, dude. Oh, do you, do you have a next part to this, Zach? Hold on. Let, let me see if there's a continued short. Let me see if there's a, a continued video. All right, guys. Let me show you this. 
subscribe to Dark Hills, guys. He he has. You gotta be. We gotta get him to 500 subscribers, dude. Dark Hills. Which one should I show? <laughs> he has so many, dude. Look at this. Look how crazy. Look at. He's got the brain. Oh, dude. Look at that. Ships on Vader are the. I'm not. Oh my. Bro, I love that colors. Look at those colors, dude. That's a coyote skull. Look at that, dude. Look how sick that looks. Dark Hills European Mounts, man. He does some good shit on his YouTube channel. He'll show you the whole process. Always fight for what you believe in. Don't give up when it gets hard. Look at that beard. Look at that beard. It's in the full video. Let's, let's. I'll, I'll show, I'm playing it. I am never gonna find it. I am never gonna financially recover from this. You guys see how all this background stuff works. Obviously a mask of some sort, so you're not breathing in the fumes. Wear gloves. <laughs> a little piece of wire or something, or even a stick will work. This is for after you spray the paint. We're gonna show, but you guys, you guys gotta subscribe. And, and, and dude, if you look at this, is how he does it. And this one came out good. And and I remember you just kind of do. In the video, you you were saying that uh, you had to do it again or something like that. Bit. You had to redip it. He is Bob Ross. Cool designs in it. That's how he does it, dude. It's so bitching, dude. When you're dipping these things, you want to go super slow. <laughs> I like the little gifts and stuff better, that's in there. If you go really fast, that paint is not going to have time to stick. If this videos were on like Do a it. morning. When I was a kid, nice like a slow. morning show, kind of when I was looking at all those woodworker people, this is stuff that fascinates me, man. <laughs> and he shows you how he wraps the whole, like you got to cover the actual antlers and stuff like that. You don't want, you don't want to get anything on them. Super I don't want to give out the video, but definitely check out Dark Hills European Mounts if you're not subscribed to. Let's, let's play some Romana Yacht. <laughs> Once you get it fully submerged, take a piece of cardboard. Squish the excess out of the way. That's just, Boy, that's a lot, of, a lot of, it can get there. expensive, dude. <laughs> How much? A bigger bucket. Anyway. Well, I mean, I, I don't know. How much are paint cans nowadays? Like 10 bucks a can? Squish it away. Big reveal. Look at that shit. And he he had to redo this one to add more white, but I'm gonna show you the finished product. Look at that, dude. Look how sexy that is. He wanted more white on it. Oh, come on, video play. Oh. How gorgeous! It's gorgeous. It I love. It looks psychedelic, bro. These are psychedelic like imagery for me. It's super cool. And look at those freaking antlers, dude. And them grooves.
Oh. Thank you for... Oh. Zach, you're amazing, man. You're amazing. You guys, give him a follow. All of his links to his stores are down below. Look how beautiful that shit looks, dude. Hell yes, Dark Hills. Thank you for sharing, brother. Mm. Who do we have? I think we have Paul. Paul was the other person that I believe emailed me. Hey, Thor. I know you sent me a package. I think business days would be Monday. I know Thor sent me a, a package. And um, I'm going to check Monday, Thor. I, I, I hope it's there, dude. That'll be like six, seven business days on, on Monday. Dark Hills. Yeah, he is a true Viking, dude. Beer's gorgeous, man. Dark Hills. Bad to the bone. Literally. Oh, yeah, dude. Is Mud Jug still available ordering? I haven't been with him for almost a year, dude. I couldn't tell you nothing about him. Ajax, Chris. Yep. Thank you, Ninja. And Green. Robert Sneeze calls him Rob Exotic because we have two cats. <laughs> Bitch. I don't know what you sent me, Thor. I don't know what you sent me, bro. But I'm excited to open it and share with the live vibe on Monday. Hopefully it's there Monday. But here we go, guys. We got Paul Miller. He's sharing up. This is a fly. this is a a fishing fly, right, Paul? Paul, you still in here, man? I hope you are, bro. Hold up, hold up. Paul's a fisherman, just like many of you guys are. But this is a. I think this is for fly fishing, right? Cause look at, I don't know what's that. I don't know where he's pinching it with, but I know people who like custom make these things and these things are pretty damn pricey, dude. Pretty damn pricey, dude. Look at him. He's got himself. Dude, what the hell is that, bro? Is that like, is that like a water depth thing? Dude, look how beautiful that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I just, it's, what did I do, bro? Oh God, I am way too you know what right now. I'm getting there. Okay, so we can look at two fishies. <laughs> Those are custom lures. Oh, you, hold up. You made that shit, dude? Just go back. Yo, how do I? Uh, that Eddie. Hold on. So he makes this. Paul makes this this custom. That's cool, bro. You got the little eyeball there. So you got to paint them. You obviously got to do the hook. And then you got to thread these things, I think. That looks beautiful, man. Hell yeah, Paul. Bitchin', dude. This is his fish he got. That's a beautiful fish. It's so so weirdly transparent. I find that weird. That's like a transparent mouth. It's like looks cute though. Oh damn! That looks like a bit like an octopus. You made that too, dude. I love fly fishing. Yeah, the only thing I know about fly fishing is that you gotta wear those jumpers <laughs> for the suspenders. And then you just like Indiana Jones, like you like Jade and Bull Whip it. And, I, and it's like a skill, it looks beautiful. You see that long ass string and they don't have a traditional reel, I think. It's like a, I don't know, but that's beautiful, man. It's a fish finder, Cody says. I love fly fishing too, Justin. So is Mudjug gone woke now, bro? Yeah, I, 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 I don't know. I haven't checked out the website, dude. Jesse and I left last May, and it's it's in my past now, brother.
Ajax, who knows? We just vibe here. Dip it. Oh, yeah. So, Ajax entered during Deal or No. Ajax, we do dip reviews here, brother. We play Deal or No Deal just like you played with us tonight. And then after that, we just chill. On Monday, Wednesday, Fridays, we do Live Viber Spotlight where we're sharing your guys' images to the fellow Live Vibers. And we're sharing, you guys are sharing your passion, what you do. Like if you're, if you're a worker, like obviously Paul is sharing his fishing stuff, dude. And um, his passions. And then we just vibe. Well, I'll take any question from chat and we just flow like water here, bro. Oh, God, that's so beautiful. That's so beautiful. Paul, that's rad, man. Hell yes. That fish hook looks awesome, but scary to accidentally jab your finger. Yeah, I hear that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's a crappy coat, he says. Thanks, Dark Hills. It's my side gig. I'm trying to get going. Paul, where do you sell your stuff at, man? Let the live vibe know in chat. Where, where could they find your uh, your fly fishing lures or your custom stuff? Fly fishing is expensive. Why is it? Is it just the reel that's expensive? Because I see it like as soon as you got the reel, like you don't got to pay the fish, right? You, but it must be really expensive then. Must be all the equipment. Probably a lot of uh, a lot to maintain too. I got you, Doc Hills. Thank you, dude. Paul, that's badass. Chris is one. How's the fish who tasted some outlaw mint? <laughs> you saw the video, guys. I did do. I, I did a review on the Outlaw Dipco channel, guys. If you guys never seen it, check it out. He didn't go for it. <laughs> he didn't go for it. I love that video. I'm going to do more stuff like that. Outside. Just tanning. Talking. It's more relaxed. Just let people know your, your Facebook name. So they can find you, dude. Oh, dude. That looks gnarly. You paid a bumblebee. Fish will bite that? Bro, what kind of fibers are those, bro? That looks crazy. That looks like a like a like a feather, dude. It looks like a like a feather. Yo, that looks gnarly looking. Oh my god, that's that's how small those are? Really? Bro, that's a quarter. He has it on top of a quarter, dude. Hold up. So like are you catching like really tiny fish with that? Or could you catch big ones with that one? That's crazy. Everything fly fishing is expensive CD from the rod and the reel and the floating line. Sasquatch, some custom lures, guys. There we go. I get it, Chris. I was just wondering. Sorry if I'm... No, 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 you're not, dude. You're not. You're vibing with us, dude. Thank you for sharing, Paul. I'm going to my DMs. Farquad vibing in chat. He, he sent me some photos like four minutes ago. I'm gonna wait till Farquad's here. Jaden, I, I know Jaden. I haven't seen these photos, so I hope they're they're good photos. They're clean photos. But I'm sharing your photos. Ooh, it's a bull whip. He makes custom bull whips, guys. Oh shit, he's got me at the big screen, dude. Oh, he's vibing, dude. <laughs> Jaden. 
Damn, he's always sniffing the good shit too. Oh, he's got to show the nips, dude. <laughs> uh, it's Lil John. It's Lil John. It's a little bro. <laughs> Thank you for sharing, Jaden. You're a rock star, dude. If you knew you had only three months to to live, what would you do? Three oh th- three months to a year, what would you do? You want to ask that question? I, 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 yeah, we can ask that. We'll we'll ask that after after this, man. We're gonna be vibing with it, man. All right, next is Ninja. First, I'm gonna show this, these photos from Ninja. Look at that outlaw dip. She has a crap load of outlaw dip too. She's got the she's got the lemon swirl. She's vibing with that. That's her favorite. She says right now. Extreme hot scent. Oh, these are. You're making me hungry now. This brought me. I'm like pineapple, dude. Pineapple. Pineapple. <laughs> Mm. Ooh, she's in her Jeep. She's rocking in her Jeep. Distinctively different. Noxy. Original elixir. Dang, dude, that's a sick bottle. It looks like old school. It looks retro. Oh. <laughs> Yo, you guys want a Millie puppet? You want a Millie puppet, dude? That's great, Ninja. That's great. I love that. <laughs> Handy squirrel. Smarties lollipops. I remember these. Oh, that chalk candy is so good. That chalk candy is so good. The candy cigarettes. I remember these. Dude, not only that, look at the prices for these. You would think they'd be super expensive. 79 cents for a pack of cigs, 189 for the... Dude, this is good prices too, man. Cow tells. <laughs> yeah, it's a dope, it's a dope one, dude. Don't forget, just, did you send pictures? We, we, I haven't been telling people. Well, I want to have people to be sending pictures there, dude. But I haven't checked Discord on this. I can check if I can see if I can log in on the iPad if you sent anything. But you know, after this, we'll we'll go so we can show people how to how to use it. Cause I don't even know how to use the emojis yet. Thor made some e- e- emojis for the Discord, so I'm still kind of learning that too. Maybe you guys can help me out here. The guava, I love guava candy, Ninja. I love guava candy. The candy six Liz, you missed those? Toxic waste, hazardously satisfying. Oh, I remember these old school peanuts. <laughs> I'd eat a couple, but then they get, they taste weird. They, they, they taste weird, but they're good. They're good. Oh, the wax. Dude, this is like super nostalgic, dude. The wax bottles. Probably not good for you. We ate these as kids all the time. Become cool drinks. I would just buy the drinks just, just to display them. They look cool. You put some lights behind those colored drinks, dude. The Noxy. Holy crap, that's a lot of soda. It's probably just sodas too. They're not even beers. Probably have, oh, dude, look at that shit. I love that kind of decor. The number seven brand neon light. Yes. I like that, right? That clock. I love it. It was a miniature Luigi board. <laughs> it's just a panda. It's a panda bear. <laughs> Whoa. This panda is showing some shit, man. <laughs> cat butt oven mitt for true cat lovers there we go Elena 
It's all you, girl. You're a cat lover. Oh my god, look at the back. <laughs> Made from scratch. I get it. That's cute. There's a lot of people in the live vibe that have cats. I remember those too. What? Astro Pops. I'm writing that down. Yeah, the Razzers, Razzles, they were like, uh, they're kind of like sweet tarts. But dude, yesterday, if you guys weren't here, we were talking about ghost stories. People seeing ghosts. And Ninja last night mentioned that it was captured in a ring camera. Bro. What do you guys think this is? This one's filmed. Oh, I'm not going to be able to. Maybe. It's going to be small, though. It won't, it won't be large, but... Look at the sky. That orb or whatever it is. See that? This floater. What's that floater? That's so creepy. The way it the way it's moving like side to side. Ah, Ninja, I think this is a picture or it's not opening. It's not opening up for me. It says it's a photo. Oh, that was a photo. Well, what do you guys think it is? I showed you the photo, right? Oh, there it is. This angle's crazy. Looks like a ghost, right? There were orbs in that video for sure. What's up, Farquad? Farquad's here. Sorry, guys, I'm missing comments. Just clocked out, fellas, King says. Yeah, Logan is heading up the Discord thing for the mods. He created a uh, chat for the mods, but I, I, I can ask him if, if he can make a, a voice chat for, for the live vibe chat. We're gonna, we're, we're gonna go through it. Thank you for sharing ninjas, keep your shit. And beautiful candy photos. Robert, you son of a bitch. I wasn't lying about the flea market socks. <laughs> Robert, we're brothers, bro. We're brothers. Socks are socks, right? <laughs> well, that was me back as a kid. I wear low cut socks. I wear, all my socks are black. <laughs> Thank you for sharing, Robert. <laughs> I wasn't lying about the flea market socks, dude. Our boy Trent. Thank you, Trent. Making me hungry, bro. I love you, Trent. You still here, dude? Look at that. He's eating some spaghetti. There's some pieces of sausage in there. Some garlic bread. Bro, I haven't had I haven't had any pasta in over a year. That looks delicious, Trent. I hope you're vibing with us still, brother. I'm hoping I can get 45 reps of pull-ups tomorrow. That's hard, dude. I can do four sets of 10. Isn't it, dude? That's freaky as hell. 
On my end, I can see someone walking in the living room, then it floats up to the sky. It looks like a woman. Well, that last photo looked like an actual like ghost photo. It was crazy. Dude, I can only do four chin-ups until my shoulders want to explode. Get after it, Farquad. Yes, dude. Robert wears knee-high socks, LOL. <laughs> Thank you for sharing, Trent. I think Trent's gone, though. Oh, no way. John, are you still here, John? John, that's right. That's what I keep forgetting is John, dude. Is John. You guys, the guy with the military photo, the, the Marine. I always call him John, but this is John from Corona. He, he visited us. He visited us. Oh, my God. This is John, dude. Where's the audio to this thing, dude? You know, put the camera up when I'm filming over here. I just thought it's a dildo. No. <laughs> <laughs> John, let me tell you this. I got a shit, man. I can't believe I didn't recognize him. I'm like, I, is that him? I couldn't see him because he was military uniform. He would stop by the shop all the time. His girlfriend, he's from Germany. And he got married to a girl that lived by near Corona. And he was a fan from Germany. And we ended up being friends. And he would visit the Corona shop all the time, dude. Like, all the time. He even saw us right after we were about to leave. And he joined, he got his citizenship, and his dream was, he was in the military in Germany, his dream was to be, to join the US Marines. And he got his citizenship and he became a, a Marine, dude. So, um, a German guy gets US citizenship, US citizenship and becomes a Marine and serves. You know, so he- the camera up when I'm filming over here. I just thought it's a dildo. No. <laughs> I gave him a tour of my, he wanted a tour of my cubicle. <laughs> Hey, hey I, shut up! <laughs> Sorry, man. I'm just kidding. No, you're good. Um, no, Chunky it's not Chris. A <laughs> this is a camera stick. <laughs> I did <you> rubber feet. <laughs> you know, put the camera up when I'm filming over here. I just thought it's a dildo. No. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, dude. Oh yeah. Fun story. When I went to college in Calcia San Marcos, next door the next to next door to the dorms where I lived, Eric and Basser was in a small little warehouse the size of that mud jug shop right there. And I would go fill up my growler there. That's how I found out about Stone, Eric and Basser, same maker. But um, yeah. They were, they were a small company only filling up growlers in a freaking little warehouse. Now they're like one of the most popular microbreweries out in the world. Dude, see your chest looks swole in that video. <laughs> no, <laughs> my chest is fucking cut up right now. It's way better than that. that that's all fat, dude. I was, I was like, I was like Logan. He was a little fat. But Jean. I'm gonna have to DM him. My like, bro, I apologize. You've been on here for the past couple times and I didn't even... I feel bad now. I wanna, cause I'm high right now, right? I wanna reply to him like right now. But all right, Cody. Oh my God, we got the before and afters for our boy Cody. Cody, you had a big beard, dude. Now the backstory to this guy's Cody's wife said, if you don't shave, there's no boobies. So he had to shave. He had a shave. This is his before picture. Also, because whenever he would kiss his son Colson, he would develop a rash. That's the main reason why he had to shave the beard off. 
because he loves his, his, his son, of course. But this is the before, this is after. <laughs> you look way younger, Cody. I bet you your wife loves it too now. What did your wife think about it, Cody? I love you, Liz. Have a great weekend. Good night, Liz. We love you, Liz. Ninja, I like making snake bites with Guinness and Angry Orchard. Ooh, what's a snake bite? Aw, sweet Liz. Good night to you and Robert. Thank you, Cody. Dude, way sharp. He looks way younger. Way younger. And his little baby boy. <laughs> Colson. He did it for him, guys. He, he did it for him. He shaved his beard for him. Awesome, dude. Thank you for sharing, Cody. We got Stillman in the house. He sh Stillman, where's this at, brother? That's bitching. Do you skate there, dude? Do you skate here, Stillman? Oh, man. I would... I'm not... I would eat shit. I would like to go on, like, a bike... Maybe some rollerblades. <laughs> I'd eat shit, dude. No, I mean, I can go up and down them. I can hop off that, that box right there, but... Yeah, I'll eat shit, Stillman. Thank you for sharing, dude. NC! Hell yes, NC vibing. He's got some selfies out. NC vibing. NC still vibing with us, man? Not sure if you saw my question earlier. What was the question? She was literally rubbing her hands on before she went to bed. She's going to love it, dude. And see you vibing, dude. You vibing, dude. Ah, he's drinking. Dude, that's Thunder Blend. You have a gator can, dude. That is bitching, man. Sick can, NC. Oh, Ninja, he's a Jeep fan. These are dope AI photos, dude. That wouldn't be a bad place to live, right? Unless there's a hurricane, you'd be screwed. <laughs> oh, that's a sick truck. That looks sick. Thank you for sharing, NC. You vibing, dude. But look at you guys can tell his hair, right? He got a haircut. He looking sharp now. Fro haircut. You have curly hair, NC. Sharp haircut. Hell yes, NC. Thank you for sharing, dude. Who's next? Who's next on Live Ever Spotlight? Oh, Liz, happy Friday, Chris. Can't wait to vibe tonight. Wanted to share the funny sticker, uh, the funny sticker Elena gave us. Dude, Elena, are you still here, Elena? Elena sent these to Liz. Made or armed American supply. I work harder than an ugly stripper. Work to death. Oh, that one's sad. Work to death. That's, that's a sad sticker. A monkey on a ball. Proud blue collar American. I love that one. Overworked and under intoxicated. Your nudes are safe with me. <laughs> she would give these to her. This shit ain't for everybody. Oh. Elena, you're, you're such a beautiful human being. And Liz, I'm glad you like them. <laughs> the, the power couple is going to love sticking them around in cool places. Is Tim still here? Bro. Tim would go and share these. I've, I've showed the next safe one, but look at dude. He's cooking himself a fat ass ham. He sent me this yesterday, dude. He's got the outlaw dip. Elena's still here. Bay's still here. Bay, those stickers are hilarious.
Awesome, NC. Thank you for sharing your photos, dude. Alright, Tim. Thank you for sharing your Outlaw Dip photos, brother. All right, I think that's it for Live Hour Spotlight. Any, if, is there anyone in the... Oh, hold on. She sent some photos, dude. She is parting tonight. Espresso Martini, Elena. I'm glad you're still here, bae. <laughs> Espresso Martini, orange wine with coffee. She vibing, dude. Oh, look at her. <laughs> Is that a troll? She likes beards. The live vibers love beards. Oh, she's digging it. She's digging it. Isn't that good, Elena? Oh, that is so cool, Elena. A zombie raven statue. That is actually pretty badass. And look at the head. Dude, that's sick, Elena. I love that. And that's perfect, especially, you know, it's, it's a zombie and it's a, your favorite team. See, the monkey one is the monkey F. No, I did not know that. <laughs> Oh, dude, Logan is a freaking bro. Logan is the most, you know, there's a lot of you guys in here. Elena, freaking Logan. Logan gives me a lot of super chats and he's helping me with the live vibe discord. You guys are super generous, loving people. Oh my God, Elena, Elena. What is this, Elena? What is this, Elena? <laughs> Booty up, man. But Logan, Lo Logan's amazing, dude. I fucking love Logan. He doesn't know it yet. But some good things are going to come his way very soon. Well, he knows it. He's in good spirits, man. He's in good spirits. Just know, guys, that the universe... Puts us in dark places because <laughs> I'm so gone. The universe puts us in dark places to make room for something better. Always. And Logan is he's right up here, man. Thank you, Bay, for sharing. I know. I love it. I love it, Elena. I love these photos. I love the gnomes. I'm a I'm a big gnome person. All right, guys. Let's let's check out the Discord really quick, huh? I don't even think I'm logged in in my iPad. Oh, I am. I am. Okay, Thor. I need your help here. Search for friends. Where do I go? Okay, so. All right, guys. We are going to go to the Live Vibe Discord. I'm going to put a link in chat right now. If you don't have Discord, get it. This is going to be the main hub. In the future, this is going to be the place where you're going to be submitting your photos. In the future. I am so hyped. I need... <laughs> oh, that's what I was doing.
So if you go to live chat here. Oh, spotlight photos. That's right, Mofo. I got you, buddy. I hope Mofo is still here. This is awesome. See how much cooler this is sharing on here? We're not on here, but it's going to be a lot easier for me. But $28 with the coupon here in Alabama. Brother, That's I can only get like three cans with that much money, brother. Oh, dude, this is sick, dude. This is how he's watching the freaking vibe, dude. Mofo. Mofo's probably gone already, man. But uh, what a beautiful office, man. Beautiful setup, dude. <laughs> He's got an Xbox controller. Oh, awesome, Mofo. I'm glad you're here, buddy. You got a beautiful setup, dude. I love it, dude. You got the double monitor. You got Outlaw Dip on here, dude. Hell yeah, brother. That's a badass photo. The cool thing about this is I don't have to, uh, I'm still learning this, guys. I'm still, there we go. I go down, and this is it. I can show everyone's photos like this, dude. Bro, he's got his retro setup, dude. He's got the old school tube TV. Look, dude, he's got the Atari Xbox. He got the badass little vinyl player. Bro, your setup is dope, dude. He's got an old school Dell computer. Probably plays computer games. Look at all the systems. Okay, I'm gonna start going on Discord now. I just, guys, I've got so much shit going on. I am so freaking busy, dude. There's so much shit that I have to do to prepare just one episode here. Um, yet, you know, film, edit outlaw videos edit shorts i'm just busy but you know what this is the most fun i've ever had in my entire life i love being busy i love doing work for me for the first time in my life i am working for myself and it's the best thing in the world he's got pitfall defender yep mofo have you seen my uh have you seen my lego atari if you haven't i'll i'll, I'll show it to the live right now it looks just like that, but Lego formed. I'll bring it. I'll show you guys. A mute here? Who's a mute here? Yeah, man. I don't know who a mute here is. Farquad, our buddy Farquad, showing off his bike. This is beautiful, guys. I like this. I don't even have to... Oh, I've seen these. I've seen... Look at Zach. Look at Zach and his boy. You have a good looking family, Dark Hills. This beautiful wife. Look at them. They just celebrated an anniversary, guys. Mr. Mofo's got his Super Nintendo. NES. That's sick. I'm I'm learning this. Alright, guys, there we go. So submit. Let's let's try this. I'm gonna do DMs for a while. I'm gonna probably do it for a couple weeks, but every Live Viber Spotlight, uh, I, I need to keep telling people to come here. It's just a lot easier for me. This makes it easy easy for me. I can see people are sending stuff right now, I think. Um, there's a Live Vibe chat. This is where you guys can, can vibe with. Now, I'm <laughs> King! King posted that, right? Farquhar posted that. Well, what's going on here? Oh, I'm at the bottom. So this starts today at 12. Okay, so this is old. The top is new. Oh my God, Farquad, what the hell are you doing, Farquad? <laughs> <laughs> Little Farquad. Oh, that's so freaking hilarious, dude. Discord is really good, y'all. Yeah, I have to join. <laughs> Dark Hills, once you get it set up, we can find a good time that works for us, brother. What are you guys talking about? Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm a little late. Plumber Girl, 
Bay, Honey Salt. I'm just going to briefly go through these guys, but just know, just know, guys. Mr. Mofo's got a huge can collection. Look how clear these photos come too, guys. Beautiful, Mr. Mofo. Thank you for sharing, bro. We do this three days a week, brother. Keep posting on there. I need to learn this. Oh, yeah, Thor. Thor made some custom emojis. Thor, how do I do it, buddy? How do I put an emoji down? Because I, 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 I do this, Thor, and I don't see the emojis you made. Thor made some custom emojis, and I don't know how to post them. So I'm going to wait for Thor. I know this chat is way lagged, bro. I'm learning it with you, Ninja. Thor, how do I put the, how do I show people the custom e emojis you made or how do I insert them? <laughs> we vibe it, dude. We're showing everyone the, the, the live vibe discord, bros. We're doing, oh, King, today at 12. Oh, look at that, I, I, I missed these. Look at this King, King built this shit, dude. Look at this shit, this is, Freaking awesome, man. Look how clean that looks. This looks like a helmet Farquaad has. <laughs> Look how clean that looks. That looks beautiful. Hey, Cody. I don't know how many times I have to repeat the chat. I, I'm doing a lot of things at once. I can't look at every comment. And not only that... When they put them in here, it's all scribbled, dude. It's it's all scribbled. I I can't. That's why I have mods, dude. I I, I and I'm high right now, brother. <laughs> See, either that we when they give priority to the people who um, like I always see like certain amount of people that are here like every day, so their comments. I think what happens is that they prioritize their comments over yours. I think. I don't know how it works, man, but. Yeah, we're doing live Viber Spotlight right now, brother. That that too. That's why we haven't. I've been doing this. Learning Discord too, bro. Try to show you, Chris, when I'm in Discord after live vibe. It's hard to explain. Okay. Well, it can be after tonight, bro, because I'm gonna be gone. <laughs> I'm going straight to bed, dude. I'm feeling gone right now. I'm not gonna be able to comprehend you anyways, brother. All right, so um, King had a really good question he asked earlier. Let's rock with that. Well, yes, guys, Discord's in the chat and in my bio. Thor's really savvy with it. I think Logan is obviously too. Um, Thor made some custom um, emojis that said live vibe and Thor's. And so like, hopefully, hopefully, um, not hopefully, I'm gonna learn it. And we're gonna be vibing there, dude. And it'll be cool for like a spot like I can post photos and stuff from like my weekends and stuff like that. And that'll be a place basically where I keep in touch. If I can ever make a live vibe. I mean, there's always Instagram, but not everyone has Instagram. Hopefully most people can download this app. But um, it's a really good app, man. It's a really good app. And Logan's busted his ass doing that. Even though he says he said it was easy. But um, I, I, I will ask him. Just give it time, guys. He's, you know, or I can, hopefully I can find, figure out some, t some time to, to learn it as well. You were looking good, Farquaad. You were freaking face flat, dude. Um, what was the question? King, are you still vibing, dude? What, what, what was the question? It was something, if you had a year or three years to live, what, like, what would you do or something like that? Did I screenshot that? I don't, I should have. I don't think I did.
can discuss it Monday. Perfect, dude. Perfect. I'm 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 super busy, brother. I'm just it's come on live vibe on, on on Monday and and explain it, brother. I'm just not in a current state of mind to be doing. I am, dude. I'm I, I am, dude. That's awesome, dude. That's awesome. But does anyone know what King asked earlier? This is where we're gonna we're, we're done showing off Live Iver Spotlight. Now we're just gonna vibe. I'm gonna enjoy this low. If you guys have any questions or any would you rather's, let's hang out, man. It's Friday night, dude. It's Friday night live vibe. I usually stay a little bit later on Fridays. Okay, perfect, King. Thank you. If you had three months this is <laughs> this music's putting me I'm so gone right now if you had three months to a year to live Wait, let me just highlight it. What am I doing? All right, guys, answer below. What would you do? All right, guys, so if you had three months to a year to live, what would you do? A year isn't that, a year's your best, dude. A year's your best. I would. That's it. I wouldn't work. I spend as much time with my family and friends and eat whatever I want, baby. Pizza, spaghetti, freaking lobster, freaking McDonald's. Oh, not McDonald's. Hardee's. I would eat at all my favorite restaurants. I'll ring up my credit card, max that shit out. I'm vibing. That's what I would do. Hang out with family and act and eat whatever I want. Ooh, I thought that that's a good one. If you love what you do, you're finding your purpose. It's a reason for you to wake up and enjoy life and enjoy the, the day. I get that, King. Absolutely. I get that, man. I would spend as much time with my family doing fun things so they would always remember the fun we had as a family. Yep. Do as much fun thing as fun. Everyone, everyone's answer should be 
what they did today. Yeah, that that goes with the Kings right there. But I live across the, the country. <laughs> all my family is across the country. They're on the West Coast. I would go down there. I'll still be doing vibes probably. Yeah, yeah. A purpose. Spread as much light as possible until I can't no more. I love that. And I can do that while being with family, so. Absolutely. Thor and JD got to figure it out. Take more risks. I love that, dude. Especially if you're someone who hasn't taken much risk in life. Take more risks. Agreed, King. If you're not living your best life and living it now, you need to change your life, in my humble opinion. Moab, dude. Moab. I love that, dude. I love that king. Absolutely, freaking lootly, dude. Green, spend time with family and friends and have everything ready when I pass and enjoy the time I have left. Absolutely. Me and my boys are knocking out the bucket list together. Oh, love it. Creating memories, right? Anyone else have an answer for this one? To move on to the next one? This was a good one, dude. I like this one a lot. If you had three months to live to... No, sorry. If you had three months to a year to live, what do you do? What do you do? Sorry, guys. I'm a little low, bros. Hang out with family, with friends, and eat whatever the hell I want. Do exactly what I am doing now. Do as much fun things with family. Take more risks, knocking out bucket lists with the boys. There's so much, dude. A lot of people nowadays live like like tomorrow's guaranteed. Oh, I'm gonna be lazy for a day. I'm gonna be lazy for a day. You know what I mean? It's fucking weird, dude. You gotta live every day like it's your freaking last, man. You gotta enjoy life. Live it up. You never know. Tomorrow's never guaranteed. That's why they always say, live in the present. Live like you're dying, Raymond says. <laughs> How do you live like you're dying? Live like you're dying. I get it, I get it. Raymond, love you, bro. Raymond Hearts from Green. We love you, dude. Do the things that make 
you happy, enjoy the small things, actually sit outside, enjoy the sunset with a nice cup of coffee. Hell yes, Randy. Every day should be like the best day of your life. You should live it that way, man. Just gotta have some fun, man. processing this guys I'm processing this JD says the crazy thing is we could all die at any moment we have to stop living in the future and live now in this moment absolutely dude that's a Moab beautiful said as Garth Brooks as Garth from Wayne's World would say Live in the now, yes. Absolutely, Thor. Life on Earth, AKA Midgard, is just a test to learn. Beautiful, Thor. Some lightning got... Damn, Thor. If money wasn't a question, what would your card be? Okay, that's we're still vibing on this one, Nancy. I'm not scared to die. I'm scared of being nothing to someone. Oh man. You're a warrior, Raymond. You're a warrior, man. You got this, dude. You fucking got this, man. We love you, Raymond. You're good up here. But you're not going to be nothing to someone, bro. You got a lot of live vibers who love you, bro. Like Darcy said today, don't chase money, but chase adventure. And what makes you happy, sometimes money makes it easier to achieve those goals. Perfect. Let's go watch Darcy. Let's watch that. It's a good segment. Sorry, NC, we're gonna have to wait, brother. Let's go back to Live Vibe After Dark. Shift this around. We're vibing tonight, guys. Welcome to Live Vibe 121. We're gonna hit up, we got Darcy coming up. We're watching some Darcy videos. You guys ever hear the phrase money is the root of all evil well like ben affleck says in boiler room anybody who says money is the root of all evil never never fucking had any i believe that money just makes you more of who you already are so if you want to serve you want to show up differently in this world you want to heal the world Heal the planet, raise the planet's consciousness, whatever it is that you want to do. Money only gives you more of an opportunity to do that at a higher level. So there's a saying that also goes, money doesn't buy you happiness. Yes and no. If you're an unhappy person, money won't change that. That comes from inside. Know that, in my opinion, what's the point of being here? The point of being here on this planet, having this experience, is to have fun, is to serve others, is to love deeper, is to love ourselves on a deeper level, is to have experiences, is to travel and see things and witness things and raise our vibration because we're having fun. Well, guess what? Money allows us to do that more and more. What if uh, not that driving a Ferrari is really that big of a deal anymore <laughs> to me, but what if buying or driving a Ferrari is something that I've always wanted to do. Money allows me to do that. So, if you are questioning or you have a certain outlook and opinion about money, 
when it comes to the purpose and saying, oh, I don't need money. People often lie to themselves. Oh, I don't need money to be happy. I invite you to take a look at that. Time is now. Let's go. Ooh. Like Darcy said today, don't chase money, but chase adventure. And what makes you happy, sometimes money makes it easier to achieve those goals. Darcy with the Moab. The force is strong with this one. Very. I love Darcy. You guys, it's Darcy's birthday right now. It's 1234 p.m. Make sure tomorrow you guys go to his Instagram and wish him a happy birthday. Tell him the live vibe loves him and the live vibe can't wait to have him on. <laughs> I'm going to work on that this weekend, guys. I'm going to figure it out how to get uh, interviews on for Darcy. And I'm going to I'm gonna probably have Big Rob, Jesse, or Spets join the first call so I can learn the whole audio up how, you know, I, I want to learn it first. I don't want Darcy to show up. I'm going to have te technical difficulties. So I'm going to test it probably early next week and um we're gonna get darcy on man he he texted me the night you know he's like dude i'll be on whenever you want me bro but um it, it's you guys we're gonna do this we're gonna do this and uh i can't wait i i, I can't wait and i'm just gonna talk to darcy bro i'm like hey man the thing is I, I gotta learn this shit i don't know what to do i'm still learn new to this whole thing but I've never conducted an interview before. So I'm gonna ask him general questions. Hey man, how? what have you been up to since the last time, you know? And then I'll ask him questions. I wanna ask him about his Bufo experience, his psychedelic experience that he had that sent him out of his dimension and he's gonna tell that story. And after that, I think that'll be it. During this conversation that I'm going to have with him, I want you guys to ask the questions, ask all the whatever questions you have for him. So after we talk about his update of what he's been up to and his Bufo experience, I'm asking him about Bufo because this is the, the live vibe and we're focusing on mental health and spiritual growth. So, and that fascinates me and that's what the live vibe is about. It's everything that uh, I'm not going to do. I'm not going to tailor to any like other live show like this is just me having a talk with my boy you know and um and then after that hopefully he'll have time i just know it's, it's not going to be a short conversation um i just hope he's able to hang out for us that long you know what i mean he's a busy dude and uh, we're both doing our own work you know and um and he travels a lot dude he he travel he's living life right now dude he's he's living life but, dude, we could talk for at least an hour, I think, easily, you know. But um, as, as long as you guys are willing to vibe, dude, I think it'll be a great thing, dude. I think it'll be a great thing. The live vibe, the, the lives will blow up when you start doing interviews. You think so? Yeah, I'd like to get Outlaw in. I, can, I mean, yeah. Again, you guys, you, you guys know this was the plan since day one. I've been mentioning, you know, the interviews, but I just wanted to master this first before I can even conduct an interview. We are still finding the DNA of the live vibe right now. You know, dude, I'm going to add, I'm going to add reacting to all my old videos, you know, the gameplays and stuff like that. I'm revamping this whole shit, dude. I'm re I'm doing the gameplays part one, Dead Island two. I'm uploading more shorts. I'm posting on freaking TikTok. Like, this is it. This is my passion, bro. This is just gonna, the live vibe's gonna, it's gonna do good, man. But yeah, this, since day one, I've been wanting to do these interviews. And Dark Hills believes that it's it's, it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna work out. And I, I know it is. I know it's gonna be awesome. And you guys are gonna be screaming for Darcy to freaking be here every week. <laughs> But I'll tell him, hey man, whenever you got like 15, 20 minutes, especially if it's literally just a FaceTime call. No, no, no. I think I have to send him a link and he can just go on his phone, right, and, and talk. But I don't know how his audio is going to come out. I don't know, you know, I don't know that whole process yet. So I'm going to learn it. I'm going to learn it this weekend.
hit the Moab for Darcy. Absolutely we did. Trust me, when you go through hell by yourself with no one by your side, it will change you. Lord knows I've been cheated and screwed over and everything in between. It is the small things that will make you. Wow. I'm just dropping freaking Moabs. That was beautiful. Beautiful, Raymond. Thor says absolutely, dude. Dude, I guaranteed I could chat with him for hours. I know, dude. Oh, me too, man. Me too. Our last conversation was like two hours long, dude. Yes, sir. Speak it into existence. Absolutely, man. I want to do one of these Darcy videos. Remind me. Monday through Friday. The live vibe after dark. I want to react to Darcy's videos. And I want to upload those separately. Like a, like a good follow up to his thing. Um, I uploaded a video last week. Of us reacting to the first Darcy video. And that shot over to a thousand views. And... Um, I definitely want to start doing more of that too, for sure. Because those are the ones that are going to... I have to upload regular videos on, on YouTube if I want to promote the live vibe. And these clips like that is going to help promote the live vibe. So it's a beautiful thing, man. And everything's unraveling the way it's supposed to, you know what I mean? Like every, It's so wild how things are working right now for me. I don't... My big thing is not to force anything. As soon as I start getting stressed out or, or overworked or I feel like then the creativity, the passion, the flow gets ruined. I like to just go at my slow pace and deal with life's obstacles as they come and just be in a flow state. But dude, it's going to be dope as shit. All right. Does anyone have another question that we could ask? Let's have a really crazy one. Not crazy. Well, let's have... This one was a serious one. Let's have a fun one. <laughs> Great question, King. I loved him asking, if money was not an issue, what would you do right now? Yeah, do totally, man. Chris, whatever you got in your freezer is chilling. Thank you, Rabbit Jamma. Did you watch the first part of this live vibe, dude? Welcome back, Rabbit Jamma. All right, guys, I think it's a good time to end it. We're going to end it here. Unless you guys want to have another question. I know this, I know this is like lag big time, and right now. My sense of time right now is completely off, but we'll see. Trust me when I say this. Trust me when I say this, because everything I'm going through, I'm doing alone. Riding, riding my ball, did that alone. Two, five, done. All I can help people just go through things myself. Enjoy life. Get all the memories you can before it's too late. Absolutely, man. You gotta figure it out. What's up with this song? <laughs> I gotta take this song out. Let's go back for the top. But yeah. You got to live it up, man. But you're not alone right now, Raymond. Just know that, brother. You're not alone right now, dude. You got us, man. And you, you're going to be just fine, dude. You're going to be you're going to be fine, man. You're a fighter, dude. I appreciate you, Dark Hills. 
All right, y'all, I appreciate you all. Pray for safety and love for all of you this weekend. Go out and create a memory with someone this weekend. Do things y'all much love. Beautiful, Dark Hills. I love you, brother. Thank you, dude. You did an amazing job tonight, Dark Hills. Thank you for modding, brother. Thank you, thank you, thank you, dude. You killed it, man. I appreciate you, Dark Hills. I love you, dude. Ninja, Green, you guys, Jaden, dude. You guys all kicked ass today, man. You guys were going above. You guys weren't even mods, and you guys were chipping in, being beautiful human beings. Raymond, you too, man. We love you, man. You're going to be good, Raymond. I just changed my name from YouTube to Episode of Super Warrior. Attaboy, Jaden. Good night, all you amazing people. Love you all. Have a great weekend. That song makes me miss Logan. I know. <laughs> we miss Logan. We love Logan. Logan's going to be good. Logan's going to be good. I love that dude, man. I love you all, guys. Thank you for making Live Vibe 121 so damn special. If you haven't done so yet, please like the video. I love you all. I love you, Raymond. Logan, you got this, dude. I love you, King. One love, baby. Absolutely. You guys are amazing human beings, man. Have yourself a great weekend. Just like Dark said, have some fun. Reach out to someone, you know? Tell me you love them. Thor out, just like this, Thor, bless up. I love you, Thor. We're gonna get the Discord figured out, brother. I know you like it, so we're gonna be vibing with it, dude. All right, guys, have yourself a great weekend. I'm gonna miss you all. Have a great 48 hours without me, suckers. I'll see you guys on Monday. Let's break the record on Monday, baby. I love you guys. Peace.